Oh, wow. <coughs> oh, bollocks. Good as Yes, people. We are back in the building. I know I've not been around for a little while, but hey, 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 ho. What an evening to come back. It's Bayern Munich versus Arsenal. Arsenal are pretty much, or we are, at full strength. So, there's that excuse out the window. Has Mikel Arteta picked the right team? Tonight, I'm going to say probably. Jorginho's there. He clearly don't like Thomas Partey. In fact, I'm not even sure if I see Thomas Partey on the bench. If we get beat 4-0, the inquest shall start later. Guys, I've got a couple of guests coming on the channel tonight. Manny, as always, my European Champions League partner. I've got a couple of guests coming Oops. on the channel tonight. And Manny WB always, shall be joining Champions. us. A little after 8 p.m. So, guys, do be getting the likes on the video and do be subscribing as we is new. Shout out to all the real ones, all the fake ones, all the fuckers, all the idiots. Locos back in the building, guys. Shouts out to them, dog. You can't take them, loco, from me. Ah, la, 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 la. Oh, God, look at them buds. Na, 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 um, who is with me, people? La, 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 You're never going to take my arsenal away. No, I'm not off my luck, guys. Right, Shouts out to John Arby. Uh, he will be jumping in and out the stream, he says. This is a quiet start, but it happens. Uh, no one with me, no? Well, fuck off, then. Uh, we'll see what happens when my studio guests do jump into the place. Who was the first comment? Jean Arby! Bro, a minute ago I had all, um, what do you call it, like hairs. My hairs are standing up, bros. You know what I mean? My hairs are standing on edge and I'm thinking, Dan, like, you can't control this game. Why are you so nervous? It's because of our love of this club, bros. Um, Jean Arby, I'm going to ask you straight away, is this the correct um, team? Uh, is this the correct uh, team formation? Well, you know, formation doesn't change at Arsenal. It doesn't change anything like that. But would you have went Jorginho on the midfield? Is Thomas Partey on the bench, bros? Is it straight racism now? Like, why the fuck won't he just give this guy a chance? Um, I've got no nails left. Yeah, pretty much, bros. I've been doing that all day as well. Fucking disgusting habit. But I'm, I'm a very clean-cut person. But look at this. Loco's come back as a flu. But you know, Loco's back, in it, bros? Loco's back in the building. Shouts out to him. Raz, this could be an interesting one. I think Manny's joining. Manny's late. This is not like Manny, is it? Because I told Manny WB is joining. He thought, fuck that. I'm not joining Danny tonight. I'm sure Manny will be here soon. Uh, they should have been. <laughs> Shut up, man. Stop choking all over me. Bruv, you see when they took the police took the dog? You see how the dog come back in bad condition? All choking and fucking shit. Uh, who knows with uh, this Ari Hotera. Bruv, yeah, he's quite incredible at just... I don't know. I don't know. Like He's talking now. I don't actually want to hear anything he says. I just want to see fucking a result tonight. Um, personally, guys, I know it's very easy to say. I think we should go that goal right at their next. What's the point of sitting back and trying to soak up the soak, soak up the Allianz Arena's um, atmosphere? I think we have to go out and show no fear. I know it's so easy to say, but we've got to go for their throats. Any opinions on Tommy Asso at left back? I embrace this. What if he's not fit? Is Thomas Party still not fit? Bollocks, 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 super fans. I just don't get it. Uh, good to see you, John. I'll be thanks for my video the other day. Hopefully just the first again of many more. Who knows? Saliba! In Saliba, I trust. Saka needs to take... Bros, it's quite simple, isn't it? The front four. Not that we have four attackers, but Eldegaard, Martinelli, Saka and Havertz. If they turn up, anything can happen. Havertz for me, super shit. If he's not at the races, I'd fuck him off for Trossard or... Jesus, immediately. Manny, where are you? Let me see where Manny's at. I hope he ain't, like, thinking funny thoughts because WB is joining. I don't want to unsettle no one. Yo, 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 where are you? Where are you? Um, it's all or nothing, bros. It isn't like we're going to win anything else. We're not going to sensibly... I'm not going to say we're in a league title race, bros. We've got many. Look, look, even Chelsea, bros. It's typical, isn't it? Even Chelsea are starting to come into form, bros. Watch Mudrak fuck with us when we play Chelsea. We've got away to Man United next. Don't worry. Ten Hag will try and save his job against us. And then away to Tottenham. And our pal, do you know what I mean? You've been slated on my group so hard about Ange. Do you know what? I've been getting it recently. Oh, you and your mate. 
fucking saying he's, he's a fat Australian cunt. Oh, bros, they 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 went for my neck over Andrew because of what me and you were saying at the start of the season. I still don't make us wrong. I think maybe Madison was his only signing. Remember, the goalkeeper was already done from that Italian geezer last season and Conti. Um, and Doogie or whatever was on loan like, bros, what's he done? He's brought Basuma back in. Madison's his player and he hasn't had a striker. I still think he's done exceptionally well because this is shit old Tottenham. But yeah, mate, they've, oh, you and your mate, John, I'll be fuck you, bam, bam. Basically from the, the two lovely, loveliest guys in the world, Lee Akers and Yui. I've just been out. Yeah, fat bastard, blah, blah, blah. Hey, I still backed it. Anyway, I still was like, listen, he hasn't had as much time as Arteta. He hasn't had as much money as Arteta. Are these even his signings? Give him one or two years and he could still be a very good Premier League manager, isn't it? Whether he gets that time at Tottenham or not, Sean Arby, me and you can only guess. All I'm just saying is the boys in the group, let me know that they reckon me and Sean Arby got it more than wrong on uh, the subject of Ange Pester Pogolu. I'm not so sure we did, bruvs. We just threw out an opinion. A, a wonderful a brand of football. We didn't say like he was going to win the league. I just said if he could rock this brand of football in the Premier League, I did know that some games could be 7 6, 4 4, 8 8. Because uh, playing, uh, doing this at Celtic was not going to be so easy as doing that at Tottenham fucking shitty hotspur. But, bros, I have to say, fuck me. He, he's done fucking well for me. Wait until he gets his... Exactly, bros, exactly what I'm saying. Wait until he gets his own players. Uh, own players. Look at where they were last season. And now they are within... Exactly. Exactly, bro. On the treble at Celtic last season. Look how bad Rodgers is doing. Andrew's a good manager. Speaks a good game too. Exactly. And you see the Asian guys at Celtic. Have you noticed they're not doing as well? Kiriagos and all that. They're not doing as well since he ain't there. I don't know if it's the Brendan Rodgers effect. All I know is I totally agree with you, Jean Arby. Guys, do be liking, do be subscribing. Don't be shy. Send the link out. Send it out to your friends, to your mum, your dad, your uncle, your sister, your brother. Um, I've got a couple of guests coming in soon. WB will be here. I know he's probably going to be running it from his phone. If his phone starts ringing, I'm going to give him a right slap in his head. And Gamaldete, we call it. Um, and as for Manny, I don't know. He's a WB's joining, so he's fucking, he's fucked off. Manny, 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 Manny. Manny, 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 Manny. But if Manny don't join and WB joins and we win, WB's going to say fucking Manny's a jinx like he was the fucking whole stream last week. But yeah, um, I'm not going to allow that to happen, though, Jean Arby. You know, if um, Manny does join, I'm not going to let fucking no one fucking try and take the piss out of him on my stream. Ah! I thought it was Manny, but it isn't Manny. Guess who it fucking isn't? Back on Danny AFC TV for the first time since, oh God, was it Man United or Palace? The racist Palace stream, was it Man United? When we've done about seven streams, it got really good views, but we had to do the stream like six times. So I got 200 on one stream, 200 on the other one, because I didn't know how to jump in and out of stream. Why has his face disappeared? Fat man. I'm putting a t-shirt on, one second. I'm removing you. No, oh fuck! What have I just done? Have I removed you? No, I'm here. All right, go on, sleep. Um, right. Stephen, turn the. Your, oh, let me turn my volume. I'm back. putting okay. my t-shirt on for fuck's sake. Hey, Steve, be quiet for a I did say this is one problem with me bringing live people on, but when I ain't got my microphone, if I don't put my microphone in, did you just you're echoing to fuck speak? Hello. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get my speak for a minute. Just talk, talk, talk. Uh, you're echoing. Hello, guys. I can't see the chat. You put the chat up. You put the chat. Comments. If I well, see I'm the comments, saying, I can't see you. Hold on, Steve. What do you mean you can't see me? The comments cover the whole screen on, on, on your phone. I don't know. I haven't streamed on my phone in a really long time. Sorry, Steve. I'm, I'm, I'm getting an iPad on. One second. There you go. There you go, Steve. That's the way to do it. Uh, you're Jeremy Carl tonight. Yeah, well, no, I don't know. I think because I said to uh, Manny, WB's joining. Manny hasn't joined. Manny's always very punctual, so... Look at his fucking face. Can you see the beard? He's already grinning. Like, he's already terrorised Manny. I was like, yeah, Stephen's joining. I think he didn't listen to the whole thing. He went, Danny, can you send the link? I sent the voicemail. WB's joining. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> I hope Manny still gets in the building. As I wouldn't want Arsenal to lose because then WB's the jinx. Remember what he called Manny last week. You are a jinx. WB, is it the right formation? Is it sorry? Fuck it, the formation. It's all well, right. actually, let me let me. What channel is it on? Is it number one, two, or three? Two, 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 two. two. I'll tell you the team, Stephen. It's the same as you are at the back, apart from Tommy Yasu at left back. Jorginho's in for Trossard. Havertz is up front. No Jesus. Trossard's up front. No Havertz is up front. No Trossard. I said. Oh. 
Let me tell you the whole team in case you're confused. Yeah, Graham, go on. Right back, White. Left back, Tommy Yasu. Saliba Gabriel, uh, centre defence. Jorginho, right, centre mid. Eldegaard, the attacking midfield. Martinelli, left, Saka, right. Havertz up front. Oh, here he is! Hey, hey! Hold on. They'll need to connect. Hold on. They're late, they're never. Drum roll time. All the way from India. It's Manny. Right. Good evening, Danny. And, uh, we, we've got we've got a guest tonight. Um, good evening to you. How are you, mate? Where the fuck? So, uh, was he doing that as a wind up? Has he jumped out because you're here? Hold on. If he's on a wind up, I'm going to beat Stephen up. You know, I know him personally. I don't know what's just happened there. Maybe it's his reception. Uh, Manny, can you talk again? Because I'm having that. I haven't put my microphone in, and I'm getting that echo. So, can you just talk for a second, mate? Listen, I'm just going to switch off the fan. Okay. No, 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 no. It wasn't. I actually can't hear the fan today. But no, it's because I haven't put my microphone in, man. <coughs> you know, oh, he's back. He's back. This, that's, that's the thing about this ridiculous. Hold fan. on, Sometimes... you're coming out a lot quieter than WB. Hold on, bro. I'm very tempted to put my microphone in. One minute, WB. Sorry, Manny. I need you to talk to me for a sec. Just continuously talk. Tell me about the team. Well, obviously, you know, um, he's gone back to something resembling his full strength team. He's got Tommy Asu at left back tonight. Thank goodness. Uh, Habers is the false nine. Um, I do believe Trossard's on the bench, so it is Saka and Martinelli. Um, I on I Habers is, side. Party on it's my, is my mate Party on the bench? The guy that comes on in the 89th minute. Oh, he should be on the bench. He is on the bench. I'm just going to take a look and see, um, confirm it for you on BBC Sport. But, um, Stephen, good evening to you. How are you, mate? I'm good. I'm good. <clears throat> right, you're coming out super loud. Manny's coming out super quiet. It's giving me, it's giving me health issues. But don't worry, guys. Let's continue to see how it goes. Right, go on. Right, so I'm just going to confirm it, but um, I'm going to silence it now because the Champions League music is playing, and I've got to do my. Go on, you do what you're doing, Stephen. Um, right, uh, quick score prediction from your WB. Close is in fucking building. What's going on? What's going quick on? Quick score that? prediction. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say. Two one us. Two one us. Fuck me. Uh, do you know what I'm going to say, Stephen? I'm going two two, and we are going extra time. Fuck. How's about that? And I don't know. Of course, the inevitable, inevitable could happen. It could. Manny, we can't hear you. No, no, he's doing his Champions League thing. Don't worry, he's very like oh. you know patriotic. Do you know what I mean? Don't worry. He heard everything I said last time. I was, I was like, Manny's on <laughs> everything I said. So he's probably going to hear everything I've said again. Don't worry. Manny's on top of his game out here, bruv. Ooh, yeah, John um, Stephen, the reason why you can't hear me is that when the Champions League music plays, I'm on mute because the last thing I want to do is to get this poor bloke some stream, you know, demonetized or whatever. And what um, I'm... I love Manny so much. Full of respect. Wouldn't decide to come in. Even though I wouldn't mind if he come in with a political statement for someone out there because he's a good guy. I'm just saying he wouldn't do anything stupid like that. That's why I had to, sorry, Stephen, give you a little 30 second phone call before the stream. Like I did. I was like, that Stephen, behave tonight, yeah? I, I, I'm not, I'm not <laughs> yeah. that bad. I know you're not that bad, but sometimes you just run with something. That's all, okay? Right. So confirmation of the Bayern Munich team lineup. There's no Davies. So Mazaru, the Moroccan, is at left back. I think he's inverted. He's right footed. So delicious. That's fireworks in the crowd. Yes, fireworks in the crowd. Look That's that why Bayern Munich, Stephen. I've had right. no um, fans nowhere. They keep throwing Goretzka, fire. Lema are the defensive it's midfielders. It's Guerrero, Musiala and Sané. Sané's past fit, so he will play. Um, might give Tommy Asu a tough time. And, of course, Harry Kane up front. I don't know what um, Tuchel's problem with Min Jae Kim is. I think he's a quality defender, but sooner or later he might have to come on. And Thomas Muller is on the bench tonight as uh, <laughs> Mathis Tell yes, and uh, Alexander yes, sure. Pavlovich, among others. Hey, 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 sorry, Manny. That Kim was fucking unbelievable. I know Italy is a different league, but Italy and Germany, I don't think, are that dissimilar. I thought that fucking Kim was a fucking beast of an Asian footballer. It doesn't matter where he's from, but he's big, strong. Like, he's, he looked even bigger than Tommy, and Tommy's quite a big like, lad, you know what I mean? He's South uh, Korean. He is Asian, you're right, and obviously he's an important player for the South Korean team. Uh, they couldn't quite um, get it together in the Asian Cup. How much did Bayern pay for him? How much did Bayern pay for him? Was it in the 40s and 50 million bracket? I'll find out and tell you in a minute. Um, but uh, yeah, confirmation of the lineup: four, three, three. Tommy, Tommy Gunn at left back, Benny Blanco at right back, Saliba and Gabriel in the centre, Rice, Georgie Porgy and Odegaard in the in the midfield, Martinelli, Havertz and Saka up up top. Party is on the bench as are Jesus, Smith Rowe, and uh, Nketiah and Kivio and Trossard. Fabio Vieira could possibly be getting some minutes tonight. We will see. Well, I hope he doesn't. 
Dyer is at centre back. I can't believe he keeps Kim out of the team, but superb. Um, I think their central midfield isn't as strong as it used to be. Lamar and Goretzka. Musiala uh, is going to fuck us up. Who? Musiala. Well, Brabs, he's an everyone. He's got exactly two years to go on his contract. He's very undecided what he wants to do in Germany. And I think he could be an available player. But then again, we've got Odegaard, Odegaard we've got Havertz, we've got Vieira, we've got Emil Smith Rowe. You know what I mean? We've got so many attacking midfielders. It seems like we probably couldn't go for an everyone. You've got Fiera in the league. I, I guarantee Fiera will leave in the summer. Well, it'll probably be on loan, Brabs, because no fucking cunt is going to give us anything near to uh, 35 mil for him. So I reckon. Give us 20 a... mil. We'll be, we'll be happy with 20 mil. Of course, we'd be happy with 20 mil. We'd be happy with 15 for yeah. months, I reckon. Right, so I can tell you that Bayern Munich are about to kick off. Harry Kane is in the centre oh, right yeah. now. Manny, and, Manny, uh, you're, you're good that minute ahead of us. <laughs> yes. Um, that's all right. Fuck it. It happened, Stephen. I'm changing my link now. Just change your link, mate. You can't do nothing about that. What can we say? No, no. He, he's no, the, he's the, 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 he's the, the, the best fucking stream. What can we say? <laughs> Look at Stephen's face. It's actually Sally. It's actually Sally. It's actually Sally. It's actually Sally. It's He's got the arsehole, look at his face. <laughs> okay, so listen, um, Stephen, if you're still behind me, then I'll stop. But Danny might have told you that when it comes to a watch along, I'll go into commentator mode. I, um, I sort yeah. of think the, the last thing, thing I think people... Go on, go on, go on, sorry, yeah. Manny. Remember, I've got yeah, the because... when we're at the Emirates, I'm fucking on clue because I've got the home fans there. I know we're not at the Emirates tonight. Manny's fully in control. <laughs> what can I do? <laughs> yeah. yeah, but um, one thing which I promise is that there won't be any spoilers and... I often say that there's nothing more off-putting than having a watch-along where people are just um, yelling at the screen as if they're sitting at um, a pub watching it on the on the on the big TV and broadcasting it to YouTube. You know what I mean? So that's why I often go into that's why I go into commentator mode. And I often think to myself, I could do at least half as good a job as the uh, guys you have on TV, at least as good as Mr. Tilsley on ITV. Um, last week, I didn't hear one word from the commentators. All I heard was you. Basically, what I'm saying is, Manny, is your knowledge is pretty much better than them. Like, I'm second son of knowledge as well. Like, yeah, I love it, innit, Manny? Like, as I say, yeah, you actually, in my in my opinion, you should be a commentator for some sort of sport out there. If it's football, fucking golf, cricket. Yeah, it, there's got that. That's 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 your calling somehow, bro. For me personally, mate. If what. if I get some opportunity, I will. I mean, maybe I could perhaps come back to the UK and try out. Um, you know, by getting a gig at a um a, a sports um channel or something. Maybe Sky Tamworth or FC. If I get a... <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, and uh, if they give me a chance, then I won't let them down. At the moment, we've got Gabrielle. And uh, listen, I'm on 140, 141, 142. Where are you boys at? Oh, uh, mate, I'm in like five to ten seconds. I'm on 12 seconds, man. So carry on. I'm on 12 seconds. Bollocks. Just 12. So you've started about a whole one and a half minutes. Well, I'm on one minute four. Oh, fuck you as well. So you're fucking, you're both well ahead of me. Bollocks to you, WB. I'm changing. Yeah, go, well, go, go to number two, but first link. All right, sweet. Right. <coughs> so, um, That's a bit Arsenal better. obviously <laughs> playing in their change um, dark green strip tonight. Never thought I'd see the day when we'd wear dark, we have a, an away strip in dark blue and also in dark green. I mean, sooner or later, I mean, we've already got a black one and we've even came out with an all-white one for a certain cause. Sooner or later, we might become a real rainbow club. Uh, not that I'd mind that necessarily, but still. Um, Manny, I think if you check our history, I do believe back in the day, I don't know if it was 70s or 80s, we suddenly popped off with a very dark green just plain kit and it just had the cannon on it. Uh, I think Adidas are trying to do a couple of retro things. I'm pretty certain on this. We back oh, in the day. Nice. Yeah, I'm very sure on this, Manny, because I think I've seen it. A dark All the leaked green. pictures. All the leaked pictures are good. Yeah. Sorry, sir? Have you seen the new leaked, leaked pictures of our kit for that season? Yeah, what, there's the blue down the side, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, I kind of yeah. like that. I don't, it's, bad. it's a home top. It's red and white. You can't really change the fucking thing. Anyway, guys, yeah. let's get into this game for five, ten minutes. I know Manny is fucking is in tune. He probably hates this small talk. God, Manny. God, Manny, take it away, son. No. By the way, I'm on my I've just had a little catch-up. I'm on two minutes. Where are you, boys? Two twelve. Three, oh, so Stephen is actually a lot closer to me because I'm now on 322324. 24. So you're a minute ahead of us. No, I'm, 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 sec I'm, sec I'm, I'm seconds ahead of you, Stephen, but as far as Danny is concerned, I'm still quite a way ahead of him. And uh, very nearly a chance. We were in the penalty area. And I'll tell you what, the Sane Tomiassi duel will be a key, but when Sane was in the penalty area, it was Magalhaes and Martinelli who were trying to, you know, um, guard him 
And as we see, Tommy Asu is a little bit halfway up the field. I don't know if he's going to overlap because he's right-footed, so he can't overlap for Toffee. He'll cut in a little bit, but he is a better defender. You could say he's a bit like um, a Japanese Dennis Irwin, but Stephen, I don't know if you would agree with me. I don't know if you agree with me, but one thing I cannot stand is the sight of right-footed guys playing left-back. And Bayern have one tonight in uh, Mazarawi, who plays right-back for Morocco, I think. We're going to have one next season. Timber's going to be our left-back next season, brother. Uh, that's all because of that ridiculous Arteta. And uh, I swear, I hate these inverted fullbacks. There's nothing more more beautiful than the sight of yeah, seeing but, a, yeah, your wing back. Saka, Saka's left footed, but plays on the right. Uh, but, but I again, know. This is what he's Go saying. Go ahead, bro. Danny. Uh, this, is what, this is exactly what he's saying. Like, I don't necessarily disagree with it on the striker thing because at the end of the day, Saka left footed. What does a lot of people like to do? Cut inside. Cut in. <laughs> yep. Saka very yeah. rarely runs down the line and clips it in. I think this is what Manny, I don't know, isn't opposed to it with the front three. What he's saying is traditionally, man. Just get a left back and a right back that's actually got a left or right foot. Because where these guys can get caught out is when a tricky wing is going at them and they're not naturally left footed and they've got to make that decision, Steve. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, our, that is... our last left footed, our last left footed good player and left back was Tierney, and all we done was got injured. So he run up there, he'll cross it in, but he'll walk back. Okay. He'll never run back. See. Whether we talk about fucking Lauren at Arsenal or Ashley Cole, if you remember Ashley Cole, bruv, yeah? Yeah. He used to be better than him, but he never fucking got caught out like Zinnies or whatever. There was none of this inverted talk, yeah? Man, he's talking you know what, Zinnies get fucking caught out all the time. He used to run up there, do a good cross, miss the ball, and then walk back. Who? But, all right, but I'm Genie. talking Ashley. Yeah, but I'm talking Ashley Cole now. I'm saying someone yeah. who's left-footed and knew, knew, knew how to get up and down the line without getting caught out. What Manny is saying is all of this running into midfield, inverted, perverted, whatever you want to call it, Stephen, just fucking defend them. Because what did Zinchenko do? This invertedness doesn't help when he's getting fucking rasped up by Salah or by Munich in the first leg, basically. Or, yeah. or, more re or for a more recent talk by the likes of Diaby and um, Bailey. Heck, even Azri Konsa ran past him at the Emirates. That really ma made me mad. And, and listen, I do want... And Konsa is a centre-back by trade. And he's playing right oh, back. Absolutely. Yeah, but then so is Benny Blanco, you know. And uh, I'll I tell you one thing. I do understand why Arteta wanted to start with um, Zinchenko because, look, Villa... Oh, what a foul. Please. What? Really foul. What's happened? You're going to see Declan Rice hit the floor in a minute. I am. Um, I'm. I'm a little bit ahead of you, and I ooh, think I missed ooh. it. But uh, yeah, you must have yeah. missed it, man. Fuck me. You got yeah, because there. I was busy talking to you lot. But anyway, listen. The reason why I had to wonder the starts in Chenko against Villa is that they were missing Douglas Louise. And if you take a look at um, Villa's performances, Louise was the one who really was being was the fulcrum of you know their attacking activity in the midfield. He and whoever was with him, it could have been Tielemans or someone else. He was the one driving everything, and he was absent. But we have to give Unai Emery some credit because he changed the formation. He had Tielemans and John McGinn playing as the defensive midfields in the 4-2-3-1. So Zaniolo and Rogers were alongside Diaby in that attacking of three with Watkins on his own up front. But uh, Zinchenko was doing well, creating chances. He actually very nearly lobbed Emi Martinez after our former goalkeeper shanked a clearance straight to him. But uh, Villa's defenders were on hand to uh, prevent that from going in. And in any case, that was going wide. So he's great in attack. But as the game goes on, he defensively becomes an absolute liability. And so the smart thing to do would have been to take him off and bring Tommy Asu on. Arteta didn't do that. Instead, he brought off Benny Blanco. He didn't necessarily have a good game himself, but he was probably our, our better defender. Did I never never liked defence. He just like, we can score five or we can concede four. As long as we win, we don't care. I get that, Steve. But again, maybe he's matured. Maybe it worked for him in Spain. Because remember, he won fucking three Europa Leagues, bro. Do you know what I mean? He done, and then, yeah, he done us on the way. No, to five, 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 five. Yeah, five, five Europa Leagues. Like, Steve, come on, that's incredible. Bro, we ain't won one. So when we win one, you can sort of have that look on your face. Five. <laughs> and then he comes to Aston Villa, bro. A team that shouldn't be in the top four right now, in my opinion. They're yeah? guaranteed fourth. They're guaranteed fourth. They're not guaranteed fourth. No, they they're not guaranteed fourth. No, it is. I mean, I look, Tottenham might have a game in hand. Yeah, Spurs have a game in hand, and really? they've also got a goal an inferior goal difference of uh, negative three to Aston Villa. But if they win their game in hand, then, you know, it's all to play for again. Well, and, you know, this league has been... This league Sorry. has been so inconsistent. Yeah. Steven, Emre wins the Conference League, and we know Conference League ain't that great, but anyway, Mourinho got it tattooed on him. Do you know what I mean when he won it? 
If he wins the Europa Conference League this season of Aston Villa and finishes fourth, please, Arsenal fans, you've got to give him some credit. By the way, you know he beat us home and away this season in, this, in the year that we're going for the title. He beat us at the Emirates. He beat us at Villa Park. Meow, meow, yep. meow, meow, meow. But he's no good, Stephen. He's a shit manager. Five Europa Leagues. And don't forget that en route to his more recent Europa League triumph, he beat us in the semis and Manchester United in the final. And I'm pretty certain in one of his Europa League triumphs, he beat Jurgen Klopp's Liverpool too. There you go. So, Stephen, he can't be that attack-minded if you're beating fucking Arsenal in the way to, with inferior teams, allegedly, like Valencia or, or Seville's. You know what I mean? And, of course, let's put uh, put this in perspective. He had another former gunner, France, uh, Francois Coquelin, playing in the defence at that time when he beat us. Stephen likes Coquelin. Stephen played football with Coquelin. Yeah, I did. Oh. I if anyone goes to my, my room, you'll see pictures of me and Coquelin. Him so, and I wonder if you're... So I wonder if your favourite dish is coq au vin. Steve? Coq au vin. Rules for you. Yeah, chicken cooked in red wine. I can't eat chicken. <laughs> oh, are you a vegetarian too? No, I'm allergic to chicken. Oh, my apologies, mate. But do you enjoy fish? Yeah. Um, Beef? Lamb? Yeah. I can eat anything, just not chicken. Okay, cool. <laughs> Cool, cool, Manny, cool. Short, long story short, some bird poisoned him with chicken years ago. I, I reckon if I cook him chicken, he's grand. I don't Dan, know. you cooked me chicken. I've ate it and I've ran to the toilet after. So, right. are you about to Manny, what yeah. minute are you on? Uh, 10 minutes 30, 31, 32, 33. And, I'm on 9 um, minutes 30. Steve, do me a favour, please. I asked you a minute ago. Can you turn the volume down on your phone? You're really echoey. My phone? Yeah. Well, what are you on? The tablet? I'm on my phone, yeah. 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 Turn the volume down a touch. It's like you're screaming. Talk again. We still no? we still haven't had a chance on goal yet, and um, Bayern have already tried to attempt on goal. But this is beautiful from Saka cooking Mazarawi there. And uh, yeah, listen, I'll make a deal with you boys. If we score, no spoilers. No, 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 mate, Matt, Manny, just give it to me because I don't care. I, I need to know authentically because someone will just come in the comments and say one nil. So. Just do it, Manny. Just just do it as it is, please. Seriously. All right. Um, Stephen, yeah. is that all right with you? Yeah, yeah. I do it when we're at the Emirates, Brav. So, listen, it's not a spoiler. It's just, mate, it's a reaction. And the reaction is to celebrate when Arsenal score. Yeah, right, I, I, can't, well, I can't get up and celebrate, but I'll, I'll do my hand claps. Mate, it's a reaction. Yeah, right, but I'm once again, terrific play from Odegaard. But this time, Kimmich is able to mop it up and Neuer clears it. Now we're sort of getting into the game. You see Georgie and Rice um, doing really... Um, you know, combining really well together. Um, the thing is, though, if Rice were to come on, who do you boys think he'd come on for? Would he replace um, Uncle Ben or would he replace Georgie Porgy? So if who, who, if who come on? Party. Um, I don't think Party will come on. It would, again, it's going to take him to the extraordinary late parts of the night, the 1870s. Reese Nelson will get on, get on before he does. I actually agree with that, to be honest with you. So, yeah, I don't think he likes him, Manny. He's not a part of the plans. He's there in absolute emergencies and emergencies only. So it depends little, what you believe, Manny. A little bit um, like Callum Chambers with Aston Villa. Emery had pretty much told him that he wouldn't be a part of the team's plans, but after Matthew Cash got crocked, he's been in a few squads. Again, emergency, isn't it? Emergency, Manny. Yeah, exactly. So, yeah, that's, yeah, that's pretty much the, the, the order of the day. Emergency purposes. Yeah. Go on, Odegaard, slip it in. Back up. Oh. Yeah. And and you see now Odegaard is using his speed very well, and Dyer is very slow on the turn. There's a reason why he's called Dyer. He is Dyer. And uh, <laughs> there was even a debate on the um, 12th Man podcast hosted by Dan Potts where Kenny Ken made it clear that he wouldn't start Martinelli under any circumstances. He still keeps his head down and runs. He doesn't learn his lesson. And um, unless he's able to come up with some moment of magic, then I don't know if the selection will will stand but you know Trossard just seems to be only too capable of doing well as an impact sub but as a starter he might Matthew. lose a bit of focus how some people would say. You can say it's big games I don't know he looked decent against Sheffield United and Luton but, um, but he, he always does against his lower league team he always does well, what I'm saying is I'd rather the guy like Martinelli in it fuck that fuck what all these people say in it Martinelli has had a shit season he scored two or three goals mate let's have, let's have it straight Everyone says Mikhailo Mudrak is shit. He scored more goals than Martinelli this season. Might have more assists as well. And yeah, and I'll tell you, I'll tell you what, when Chelsea do come calling at the Emirates, I think Mudrak will be looking to silence a few of those doubters. So do I, I thought he already did. I, I thought he already Let did when he lost Padre from the from the left wing at Stamford Bridge. 
And of course, we will see Mudrak in action for the you know, Ukraine no, at the Euros. I would not be in the team or even near to the team unless he was a fucking class burke. Exactly. Uh, guys, I've been told about the echo. Let me ask from who? Manny or WB? Manny or WB? It's not me, mate. I switched off I my fan you, and Manny. the air conditioning. I, is I don't think it's you either. I'm just asking this person. Mm. Hold on, I'm waiting on a reply. Guys, do be liking, do be subscribing. So far, so good, I'm going to say. I'm going 2-2 tonight. WB's gone 2-1. Manny, I actually haven't had a prediction out of you. Um... I think it will probably be a close uh, Bayern Munich win. I was predicting 3-1, but now I'm going to change it. I think, you know, the losses of Nyabri and uh, Davies at, uh, have weakened them. But the fact, that Sa the fact that Sané is still fit is still a cause for concern. And I am worried about how our Tommy Gunn will cope with him. Sorry, WB. Put it down two more shots. Honestly, I've just had a complaint. I'm not saying done anymore. I won't be able to hear you. Oh, fuck. All right. You see, when you talk, I'm not in a rude way. Sort of just try and keep your decimals down. I'm having people yeah. complain about it. You're just echoing mad bros. I told you at the start. Honestly. What would I say? I don't anymore. You won't, look, I'll turn it down. Delict. Speak. And that is oh, dire. It's bad. Fuck it. Don't worry. It's just as bad. Leave it. Don't worry about it. Go on. Anyway, uh, Manny, give me a quick... I'm, I'm on the 14th minute, Manny, so I take it you're just over 15. Yeah, 15, 13, 14, ah, and 15. Have you got a pair of headphones? I've just been told. Tell the, tell the prick to fucking put headphones on. So sorry, man. Hey. Can you get my headphones? Yeah, nice one, Steve. I've just been told, told the prick to put headphones on, man. It's too much. Man. Mm -hmm. I swear to God, people are saying they're jumping out the stream. They can't handle it. I'm, she's getting headphones for me. One sec. All right, nice one. Cool. Oh, this is awful. Sane cooking Tomiyasu, but great defending. And it's a corner for Bayern Munich. But uh, I'll tell you what, you cannot lose sight of Leroy Sane for one minute. No. And it's, this is a guy I've kind of um, Said, I don't know if I'd bring him to my club. Uh, I know he done well at Man City. He used to roast us when he played for Man City. He's just seemed ever so inconsistent in Germany. I don't know. Maybe it's a Thomas Tuchel thing, but I don't know. Like, if he's proven in the Premiership, then you know what's not to like. Oh, hey, what's going on? I th Real Madrid. I think I've took the lead. Yeah, yeah. Vinicius Jr. Oh, oh yes. 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 Rodrigo, 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 hopefully at the Emirates next season. I'm telling you. I've been told um, by a fucking good little source. They got this one. Real Madrid won Alfonso Davies. Real Madrid won Mbappe. And they won, uh, what's that kid, that centre half? Was it Lil? Yo Yo or something. What's his name, Manny? Let me Yo -yo. look that up for you because I also know that um, Samuel Mtiti, the former French International World Cup winner, also <laughs> plays for Lille. As does um, Davies' fellow Canadian, Jonathan David. Yes, but hold on. Well, the point to the story was, sorry, it was um, Real Madrid, basically, are going to have to find. Yeah, I, I, I heard you. I heard you. And listen, Mbappe's gone to Real Madrid, regardless of how PSG do this season. I'll tell you what, I was watching them play Barcelona, and I loved how Barcelona's youngsters did. But where, once that bloke Araujo got sent off, I mean, they just imploded. It was horrible to see, really. Shouts out to you, Shay. WB's gone missing. How are you doing, Shay? Please get a massive like on the video. And of course, the uh, you know the uh, Saka versus Neuer penalty shout was still do uh, dividing a lot of opinion. There were some people. Um, Ian Wright and Thierry Henry said that that wasn't a penalty, and uh, Neuer actually deserves credit for you know um, using his experience to try and um, uh, you know goad Saka into trying to um, yeah you know look for a penalty. Sometimes this is what you talk about when you talk about experience in itself, Manny. There you go, like, would you bring an experienced player over a kid and blah, blah, blah. Yes, so it is Lenny Yoro, a centre-back for Lille. And um, as I said, Samuel Mtiti is also there, um, yeah. along with Jonathan David and uh, Nabil Bentaleb, the um, Algerian. Any more do I recognise? Um Tiago Santos, is that a fun name? No, 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 I don't quite recognise him. Guys, and of course, and of course, our former goalkeeper Vito Manone, he's playing for Lille as well. Fuck you, no. You tell right, right, for a temporary little second. I'm getting the microphone out because I'm getting told the echo is fucking terrible, regardless if it's me, Manny, WB now. So hold on. I think it's my laptop, guys. So um, I've got a new laptop. I just haven't put my channel on it. Not your mic. Right. Hold on. 
Yeah. Maybe it's your volume. So, no, I'm uh, going to go in the mic. One second. I'm going in the mic. Uh, yeah. Settings. I'm going to just try this. Hold on. Let's get the old Gregory's on before I do something stupid. Um, audio uh, built in. Nope. Um, use microphone. And bang. Use microphone. Bang. Let's get WB back in. Um, let me just... So you say it was you, not me. Yo, 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 can you hear me, Manny? Can you hear me, guys? Loud yeah. and clear. I can hear both of you. No, no, I can't hear none of you. Fuck this. Talk. Anyone? Okay. Yo, hello. I can't hear none of you. Fuck. Let me let me try. How much what would a woodchuck chuck, chuck if a woodchuck would chuck with? Manny, can you hear me? Oh, Loud and clear, Stephen. Sweet. Anyway, coming up to 20 minutes, it's still nil-nil at the Allianz. And uh, I'll tell you what, I like okay, the now way that, that um, now, now you see um, Georgie and Rice getting into the game a lot more. And, um, yep, well done, Saka, for controlling that. Um, Shay, and, I'd love uh, to bring you on, but I've got a couple of technical difficulties. People are telling me about echoes and everything, and I've already got two guests. Next time, mate, it's not impersonal, but I've got a couple of technical. WB and Manny, can you fucking hear me, sorry? Yeah, we, we can, can hear, hear you. you loud and clear. That's not a problem. Don't and worry I can, about that. And w, so I don't know what the guests are hearing or viewers or whatever, but you're definitely not um, echoing on my side. And WB is like it's driving me mad. It's all mad, and I'm fucking getting constant messages. It's you, it. not me. It might be my computer, but then why ain't Manny fucking Tell me echoing? Ass. But anyway, I, someone's told me it's all of us. Anyway, so just bollocks to you. I don't get it. Anyway, guys, fuck me. I'm getting, I'm on the 98 oh, 19th minute. Manny, talk to me. Where are we at? Uh 20, 34, 35, 36. Martinelli in the penalty area. Come on, Gabby. Oh, but some good defending there. Neuer's able to gather. And uh, you know, just when you think Bayern could be in trouble in Europe, they somehow managed to find a way to get back. And um, you know, I'm also a bit worried now because City are currently down. If Real Madrid go on to beat them and we lose, then that is really going to muck up our coefficient because we're now depending on Aston Villa effectively going all the way into the conference um, league and winning. Not that, league and who would you, be enough. Possibly neither, but I'll ask WB first. Who would you rather fancy Arsenal's chances in the, sep in the, in the semi-finals? Would you rather play Man City or Real Madrid, Steve? Man City. Man City for me too. Wow. Fucking interesting, guys. Because um, I'd like to think that so far we've had something resembling an Indian sign over them. And it was, of course, Gabriel right, Martinelli who scored different. the winner at the Emirates uh, against him in the league, well, albeit a deflection well, off uh, Nathan Aki. Right. And uh, that is... Uh, this bird messaged me one more time about the fucking sound on the fucking... Yeah, I'm not going to do that. But, right, I'm going to I'm try turning this. off the air conditioning. So there's no external noise from my side. I'm going to try and see. Hopefully, this is good enough. It's not but... you, Manny. I don't, I don't know, Manny. Don't, just, I don't know. Bollocks. I'll watch it later. I'm going to try headphones now. Let's see if these work. A little treat. Yeah. I believe it is, is my... Your... It's my speaker. Oh, uh, an advantage being played. An attack down the left wing. And once again, we're being... Oh, slip through. Oh, and I'll tell you what, that was not too far away. Mazarawi there, the Moroccan international. I said he couldn't overlap for Toffee, but um, he's run right in and proved me wrong. I'll take Gabriel, around, right, playing guys. offside. Oh, boy. Did you want um, stats for Midrak and Trossard? It is a corner, though. It is a corner, though. I think it came off uh, Ben White last. So, Kimmich with the corner. Right-footed, away swinger, hoping to try and find a teammate, maybe. But, uh, important piece of defending there from Ben White. Headed away this time by uh, Deckers. But it is with Leroy Sané now. Right, guys, microphone check. Can you boys hear me? Because I've got you in my yep. ear. Yep. Right, lovely. Yep. Let's see if there's no echo in. Right. Guys, fucking hell, thank you for being patient with us tonight. Uh, technical problems, like a motherfucker. Uh, Shay, as I said, look, I'm changing microphones. Look, now I've got an earpiece in. But this is quite good, though, because I can hear you guys beautifully. I'll tell her out. Shouts out to you, Hussein Jumar. Ya Habibi, Masal Khair. Barakallah, Palestine. Oh, I've been told already that's so much better. Yes, respect. Okay, I watched that for a top-up in the track. 
God damn. Right, go on, tell me about Mudrak. Go on, tell me. Sorry, I just wasn't with you for a minute. I tapped out. So, tw- 25 appearances this season. Four yep. goals, two yep. assists. All right, cool. Mine four, yellow, four yellow cards. Oh, you want Martinelli? Okay, give me yeah. one second. I wasn't comparing him to um, Trossard. I said Martinelli, by the way. Okay, okay, okay. I just forgot. One second. One second. Martinelli. God damn. Martinelli. Okay, 29 appearances, six goals, four assists, one clean sheet. So you still got two goals more than Mudrak. All right, And cool. two assists more uh, than But him. again, look where we are in the league, like blah, blah, blah. We're in. We're the better team, allegedly. I nearly played a few more games. I actually thought it was slightly different. You know what I mean? All right. Fair he played enough, four more say. games. He played four more games. Got two, two goals and two assists more than him. Yeah, but here's the thing about Chelsea though. They are starting to get a bit of momentum, and they are still in the semi-finals of the FA Cup. If they reach the final and somehow manage to win it, I think Pochettino should be given a little bit of an extension, and Mudrak will still enjoy playing under him. Look. Um, the uh, turmoil, really, uh, the previous season before Pochettino came in couldn't have done anyone any good. Bear in mind, Aubameyang was there. Oh! I love playing. Sorry, I've just looked at yeah. the shop. I know you're ahead of me, Manny, so it's no point me. Yeah, I saw that. Raya with the save. Yeah, and yeah, uh, yeah. Kimmich wasn't quite able to um, do too much with the follow-up. But already uh, the uh, Brentford on-loan goalkeeper called into action. <laughs> Shouts out to Jean RB, Hussein Juma, all my real ones. Please be liking, please be subscribing. Shouts out to WB, to Manny, myself, Danny AFC TV, real ones. Um, oh, yeah, Manny, yeah. Did, did you notice I cooked for Jermaine Pennant the other day? Yeah, I saw the photograph. Well done. Um, yeah, I know he went to he Liverpool. Was, yeah. He wasn't, he wasn't really in, a, in the greatest. I can't be lie. Like, he wasn't really having it. Basically, I think if I'd have said... Um, I think he's all pointing me in the... Bubs, what a cunt. Sorry, sorry I don't mean that. What, <laughs> pointing me in the the, the, the um, direction of his agents. Yeah, talk to them and, like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I'll, I'll, of course I'll stream if you talk to my agent. I was like... Yeah, that's wait, at least four grand, five grand. I wouldn't go that much, but still. Um, I've got a bit of a stomach bug going on. But apart from that, I'm fine. I hope you and the family are well, still alive. Oh, yeah, uh, Johnny, sorry to hear about the stomach bug. You better be careful. I mean, you can never trust anything, whether it's the food or the water. You make sure you take care of yourself, all right? Um, or the there was actually a bug London. that was affect. There was actually a bug that was affecting quite a few of Aston Villa's players, which is why they fielded a below-strength team against City at the Empty Head. And a lot of these um, Arsenal <laughs> fans were crying on Twitter, "Why did Emery bend over for City but play a full-strength uh, a full-strength team against us? He didn't play a full-strength team, you numpties. He was without Douglas Luiz and Matthew Cash, and he still put a beating on us. A beating." A beating on us. Beating, a beating. I love that. So I love WB loves that 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 terminology as well. Yes, a beating. Uh, beating. A beating. He boxed our ears. He Home knocked our blocks off. Home and away. That was a nice program, although I always preferred neighbours more. <laughs> <laughs> Home and fucking away. Right, guys, do be liking, do be subscribing. So far, so good. Um, are we going to go all the way? Is this going to be extra time and penalties spectacular? What's going on, guys? We, we uh, need an early goal, but it's only like halfway through the first half. Yep, 27 minutes on my clock. And um, I'll tell you what, though, we um, it isn't uncommon for us to score after 30 minutes or just before half time. And um, I think. We, we seem to be, our midfield seems to be doing really well. Georgie and Rice seem to be working well in tandem with one another. Odegaard finding spaces, but Bayern's defence has somehow I'll show you what they managed are doing, to... I'm noticing, boys. Every time Martinelli or Saka gets the ball, obviously you're just not going to let them have fucking free two man up. But yeah, it's two man up and they're giving them a clip if necessary. Sani's just, well, what I've just seen, I know you've probably seen it a minute ago. Sani's just took Martinelli clean out before he... Go on, Odegaard. Go on. Oh, Odegaard's so greedy. Like, nothing dirty where you're going to get yellow or red carded. I'm just saying, they're not having it. This is where Declan Rice, 105 mil, no disrespect, he's got to fucking take control of that midfield, isn't it? Especially where he he's got should. Jorginho. This is especially where he's got Jorginho alongside him. Jorginho, you fuck off a little bit back. I'm not saying Declan Rice attack. Just grab the fucking game. 105 mil, grab the game by the fucking neck, man. Come on, Deckers. This is where we need I, your 105 mil. I would agree. And worryingly, if you take a look at the trends, um, Decky actually ends up playing a little bit too deep. He's almost effectively a centre-back at times, while Georgie is a little bit further forward. What you're saying is the role should be reversed, perhaps, I Basically, imagine. yeah. Not that I want him to attack in. He ain't an attacking mid. I'm just saying, yes, reverse them roles. Make Jorginho sweep up everything, and you dominate the fucking centre-mid. Make sure Kimmich don't fuck around. Goretzka don't fuck around. And look for a couple of gaps. 
That makes sense because Georgie still doesn't have the legs, in my opinion. Exactly. I'm, I'm still just make him, as forward. you say, the fifth centre back. Make him the fifth centre. Just get him a fucking in front of the centre backs. Oh, mate. Would you prefer Declan as a back five than Georgie? Oh, Buzz, we're talking a deep line. Naya with a brilliant save there. I'll just um, replay the action. But this is where we're starting to get dangerous. And this is where Odegaard is now starting to earn his bread. I really love this. With a little help from Tommy Asu. I think he found the space to shoot. And the ball was bouncing awkwardly. But Neuer with a big left hand there to claw it down and prevent it from crossing the line. And at the other end, Musiala forcing Raya into a save. And... Uh, yeah, so they it's looking good for us, and I'm really happy. And uh, Neuer coming out to smother himself brilliantly, but he has to go back because Saka has the ball. This is looking good from Arsenal coming up to the half-hour mark. <sighs> Sorry, I'm waiting to see the it's save. It's so annoying that you're ahead of... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, um, yeah, it's bugging me. Stay. What can In you any do, case, the, ox the offside flag has been raised, so that'll give you boys time to have a breather. <laughs> Guys, do be liking, do be subscribing. Got a suck on the left. Man, early start of work for me tomorrow, boys. Jesus. I might do a quick um, reaction after this, depending on my mood, depending on the score. Oh, I, uh, I just saw that save. Oh, my God. That was nice. And he scrambled to prevent that from going wide for a corner. I mean, yeah. I'll tell you something, someone who's about Manuel Neuer. His best days are long gone, but he is still a pretty good, um, pretty damn good goalkeeper. The only problem oh, yeah. is... Oh, yeah. I think his best... His, 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 um, his best days are gone, but he's still better than Rio. <clears throat> well, anyone's better than Rio. He's also, in many ways, much better than Mark andre to Stegen, but because of Neuer and Nagelsmann falling out, I don't think Neuer will be playing in the Euros. Aha, I see. Oh, you cunt car. Georgie playing it forward to Odegaard. Martinelli! <laughs> that was way offside. What got Manny grinning like that, for fuck's sakes? I wasn't grinning. I mean, look, Odegaard and Georgie doing some great work, but Martinelli spoiling it by kicking it straight at Neuer. And you can see Arteta is fit to be tied. <laughs> I mean, not apoplectic, but definitely fit to be tied. You know when the keeper has the ball at, at the foot, why don't you just attack the keeper, make him do a mistake? Why don't you have him just stand back and just wait for him to kick you? Don't know. So it's just, you've seen goals, Stephen, like that, where yeah, you panic a goalkeeper, etc. I don't know. Well, it's wasted on Neuer because look, he's experienced enough to know that if there is someone, you know, running in at him, he'll just um, swerve out of the way, move around, <laughs> yeah, and then take the goal basically. kick. It's yeah. it's not like it's it, it's not like Ivo Gerbic um, <laughs> for Sheffield United. And what disappointed me about that mistake by Gerbic was that he's had experience being back up to Oblak at Atletico Madrid. You'd think he'd um, know a little bit better, but there's a reason. Oh, why some... Eddie. Oh, you yeah. shit cunt. Yeah, you, you just oh. saw that. There's a reason why some goalkeepers are destined to be backups and never the main man. Always bridesmaids, never bride. Oh! That... Anywhere else. Anywhere Fuck else. Me. That goes in. Anywhere else, mate. Oh, you're not going to get many chances better than that. Oh, uh, Gabby, 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 you absolute bozo. How could you? You dawdled on the ball and allowed King Mate, to take it. you do it, that? You just fucking you. smash it. If the goalkeeper, if you don't know where it's going, how the fuck does the goalkeeper smash that, you no good cunt? Fuck! Yeah, you should have said that to Trossard when he had that hey, chance hey. against Nemi Martinez. It's the that was harder to miss than he used to score. He still missed. What does that mean? Look curious. Manny, over to you. I do believe she, she means that we're both uh, very talkative. Garrulous, for want of another word. Fucking hell. Well done, I bet she I bet you, you, you fucking smart ass. That word. Well done, Manny, for knowing. Fuck, what, what did Stephen say? She lit in a dictionary for that word. Okay. I, I, I don't need a dictionary. I've got Manny here. Bollocks to you. <laughs> I've got Manny. I've got Manny. Here. No, I don't know all the words. You know that. I will have to look them up for you. I don't want to BS you, if you know what I mean. No, I know. But again, in just in you're, you're an educated dude. That's all I mean. Just that's simple as you're an educated dude. Anyway, guys, Manny, give us the update. Where the fuck are we in the minute, minutes? Uh, 33, 30, 30, 30, 31, 32. Oh, He's literally a minute ahead of me. 
Yeah, so that's why you won't see me do too much in terms of commentary. But uh, but listen, Stephen, it's wonderful to have you on. The more the merrier, I always say. There you go. Definitely. We'll definitely switch it up, whether we're in or out of the Champions League tonight. We'll give WB on on. the next available league game. And obviously, if we go out tonight... uh, Georgie picks Musiala's pocket and wins a corner, uh, uh, concedes a corner. And uh, we haven't had a corner up till now, but... um, End-to-end stuff, definitely not cagey. And uh, Bayern Munich having their moments, but uh, good defending that from the uh, Brazilian-Italian. I love you, Manny. Do you know when I just start something like that, like the Billy Blanco, or the, or the just, yeah, the Brazilian-Italian, what, well, the Gezo weren't good enough to play for Brazil, so now he's fucking Italian. <laughs> I mean, well, he was born in Brazil, so you just hit the nail on exactly. the head. He couldn't play. Well, I've never met a fucking Italian called Jorginho, mate. And a Saka taking one in the head oh. there. You can't call that a foul. You have to give a drop ball okay. for that, really. I forgot I, I forgot I By the way, I forgot ball. to tell you the name of the referee. Danny Mackley from the Netherlands. Mackley from the Netherlands. Why have I still got this mic here like it's doing anything? Why not fuck off? I'm talking to it like it's doing something. You're in my ear. Bollocks. Yeah, um, this is... Saka might have to be tested for a possible concussion, maybe. But uh, we'll see how that goes. And the boys are now That's having good. a drinks break. Tell him to come to 10. It'll be fine. You know. Ask him where he is and come to 10. Go on, Georgie. I like that little slide tackle on Musiala. Don't know fucking about in the box or not. That's risky. Anything in the box and you're sliding. And then the slight kick. Yeah, the worst worst part is I can't hear what's going on. So have they won a free kick to Arsenal? I have no idea. All Kimmich did really was smack... um, Smack oh, him right in the head with the ball. Oh, suckers down. Can someone stop getting shot? <laughs> hmm. You know, a lot of them... Um, uh, and you'll see in a minute. Watch him oh, get shot. Like... The ball just hit him. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> that. That's, 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 even, that's less than the pellet. I'd rather get fucking hit with a ball than the pellet gun. Pff, but everyone's still getting shot. <laughs> When I was young, uh, when I was when I was younger, I used to get hit in the head with a ball many times. It hurt like billio. What could you do? But I used to be such a bastard. I remember, um, I don't know whether it was because I was a little fat kid or something. Everyone around my age, mate, they, I was like, right, stand at the wall. What, your what goalkeeper happened? today. Wait, what, wait, what happened? No, I'm talking. So your goalkeeper today, bang! I'll try and smash everyone, Manny. I don't know, little fuggy me. Why is everyone shouting at each other? What happened? Why are you so happy? I don't know. People are just making me laugh today. And, and Arsenal ain't getting beat so no. far. What is going on here? Yeah, well, I don't know. Well, the referee was playing an advantage, but now he's awarded Bayern a free kick instead of a throw-in. So Bayern are starting to gain a bit more possession. It's starting to get a little bit um, cagey. And I was thinking that Dyer and Delict would be uh, weaklings, but I'll tell you what, Bayern's defending has been on point tonight. Bayern were with only one attempt on target from Musiala. Well, Arsenal with two. Listen, Dilly isn't shit. Dyer is just Dyer, but yeah. Dyer fucking bollocks. <laughs> That's it. Hurry them up. Hurry them up, Arsenal, man. And then you get Tommy that just takes two years to take a throw in. But great stuff from Decky, forcing Lamer off the ball. Havertz! But uh, once again, haven't. defending has been Havertz haven't done it today. Oh, yeah, and I like the way this adjusts. Re- this is pretty shit hot, this is. <laughs> Hold on, this means... Sorry. <laughs> I think that's also another reason why I think um, Arteta tried to change it, because if you observe the last few games, Havertz wasn't quite able to really do it. He couldn't do it against Bayern and uh, a few other teams. And uh, But great pressure from, De- from Declan, forcing Lehmer to concede the ball, but uh, it was Lehmer, actually, who okay, redeemed Manny. himself with an important tackle. I want to tell you I mean, something. Do you yeah. remember I said... Uh, regarding we was doing a stream i'm pretty sure was it ue or someone come in and said uh key war has been wonderful absolute wonderful godsend blah 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 i remember saying mate half decent against sheffield united but i'll tell you what i'll rate him after man city and Bayern. do you remember this manny yeah it's so I I mean, well, i'm just saying i'm just saying it is i'm trying to blow my own trumpet what i'm saying is key wars now at the left back okay pretty simple I don't know why he fucked with the whole Jorginho should be party. We know what he oh, does. The two attacking midfielders yeah. against Bayern. But again, this is, I don't know, is it called Arteta's Lord? This is the weird thing about Arteta. Um, 
Sorry, it's because I'm behind. I should realise, obviously, if we'd scored, but I'd know by now. But, yeah. I'll take her out. Shouts out to you, Hussein. I've got to get a drink in a second, boys. Because there's nothing in that. But, yeah. I don't know. Arteta is a very frustrating guy, and it's, it takes to the obvious, like key wall looking all right. I'm not saying you just drop him when the big guns come along, but it was obvious for me he wasn't going to cut it. He's a he's a he's a centre back playing at left back. Yeah, he he got shot on the floor. He, but he's dead. He wasn't. It wasn't going to be Man Man City was going to be a test. Bayern Munich was going to be a oh, test. Really you know what I'm saying? And he's already. I already said he he's already failed the test because he wasn't there for the second half. He Bayern Munich. Do you understand, Manny? Yep, yep, yep. So there you go. Like fucking. Uh, Fuck our time. I can't do this down. Exactly. I, I mean, down. you know, you know, but but then here's the thing. I mean, just because apparently, according to um Stephen, um Tierney doesn't really suit Arteta's tactics. He doesn't really, you know, run back as much. You know, now we're in a problem where we just can't seem to have a left back who can really, you know, defend. And we've got two on loan. Why have we got two on loan? Like, you know what I mean? We weren't that stocked up. Okay, Timber was going to be a left back. Well, remember, he's fucking right footed again, Manny. But we're going to get back into the inverted perverted. Come on. Yeah, well, Tim, Timber can play any any place on the Who on the told defense. you that, Steve? Who told you that? Did you read it? Because I've seen him play a couple yeah, of times. I've, and I've seen him play for Holland and I've seen him play for fucking Ajax. And I'll tell you what, I promise you, as God and Allah is listening to me, I've never seen him play at left back. Okay, bro? Ever. Yep. I, I agree. I've seen him I agree. back. Yeah? But mainly, I've seen him at right back. Consistently. Do you know when, when Ajax were playing Tottenham that time, Champions League? Right back, right back, right yeah. back, right back. Bro, he's a fucking right back. Yeah. He certainly can't be compared to Dennis Irwin so, yet. And I've and never, I ever, ever Holland, seen him play left back. back. I have. 20 minutes versus uh, whatever. Aston Villa, whatever. The first day of the season. That was the tw- first, only 20 Nothing minutes I've Forrest. seen him play. For, uh, there you Nothing go. I didn't think you, I thought I was trying to say Forrest first, but I thought, fuck me, I didn't Premier League then. Uh, Havertz is just pure shite. Fucking absolutely. Never good enough at this kind of level, bro. Fuck that. Tommy, uh, he's never good enough until he scores. Into the penalty Just back area. in fucking building. But, uh, Benny Blanco. So much better with fucking headphones down. So much fucking better with bastard fucking phones around fucking head. Hey, always better with your headphones. <laughs> Why does the manager sound so northern? <laughs> northern? You think he sounds northern? He, he just did then. <laughs> Oh, he probably just rocked an over for you. Fucking hell. I'm looking up and just see if I see Saka running through. The problem is, whenever I try to sound Scottish, for some reason I end up sounding Irish. I think I've been spending a bit too much time with Del Boy. Shout out to Del Boy Gunner TV. What's the crack? What's the bleeding story? I'm going to see if he's got a call in show scheduled later on after the game. Should I call in and be like, when Irish eyes are smiling, <laughs> just a second. When Irish eyes are smiling, oh, oh what level? Let me get another. Let me get another Irish classic. I can't. Mate, 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 if, mate, if, mate, mate, if, mate, if oh. we lose tonight, don't even think of singing that song because I tell you what, <laughs> Irish eyes will not be smiling. They'll be angry. Why did Blanco just kick the ball out? Because he passed it. Ben White trying another, volleys. Another of my Arsenal um, supporting friends it, calls him calls yeah. him Tenerife Ben. Tenerife Ben. That's quite us half decent. I'm gonna. I'll, I'll have it. I'll have that one. A bit of Tenerife. No, no, no. Benny, Benny Blanco is class. You you came up with Benny Blanco. Benny Blanco is class. I'm not too keen on Tenerife Ben. I think Benny Blanco really, really. I think is. I think that's just about the orangeness. And obviously, I call him Orange Man at times. But there was too much in the Rangers thing, so I thought I'd drop the orange man. But yeah, I think I think I just get it because he's so orange. Tenerife, Ben, you know what I mean? Call it Jimmy Akan Ben. Jimmy Akan Ben White. Jimmy Akan White. <laughs> he's, he's just way too tanned for the brother yeah. that he is living in London. I've got to get a well, drink, boys. Take over two seconds. Well, I'll tell you what, Orange, we glad that he plays for us. That one didn't work. <laughs> it's a sort of a, um, a, a middle school joke. Um, it would have been a little bit. Uh, too boring for you. You know, you have this, uh, you, you, it reminds me of this old knock-knock joke. Um, you know, knock-knock, who's there? Apple. Apple who? Knock-knock, who's there? Apple. Apple who? And then it goes Apple for a long period of time, and then finally Orange. Orange who? Orange, you glad all those apples are gone. Oh, wow. That, I think that joke just went straight over my head. <laughs> Aren't you? Aren't you glad? Orange, you glad? Yeah. I, I think I'm just a bit too young for that. 
I get that. I mean, Danny might get it, obviously, because he and I are somewhat similar in age, I'd like to think. But uh... I'm, not, I'm not half of Danny's age. That explains it. Well, well, like 16, 17 years younger. Oh, boy. Yeah. Another version of that joke sees um, people say uh, granny for the first few times, and then it's aunt, and then the punchline is, aren't you glad you don't have, you can't see those grannies yeah. anymore? That's the sound of the police. Is that one worth better than orange? Guys, so far so good. Approaching halftime, Arsenal fans, please be liking, please be subscribing to the Realist. Shouts out to my guests this evening, Manny and WB. Shouts out to everyone in the chat. Yeah. Uh, WB, B, B. WB, B, 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 B. Could it be on Daniel OCT? B, 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 B. <laughs> All right. <laughs> this looks really good. We're starting to build something in the midfield here, but. Uh... Forced back and going out of play. No, he can't. Coming up to coming up to stop the I can see a fucking penalty shoot out by me, man. You came what I mean, eh? Completely agree, laddie. And if it goes that far, seriously. Look at Colin next comment. Look at Colin next comment. What's she saying? Um if WB's loud claps your ears are con. Yeah, but mate, I know about it. Mate, I've actually remember I said he's the only <laughs> human being I've wanted to punch in the head. He was sitting right next to me. I'm on a watch along, Manny. But he generates a noise in it. Like, blood, I'd end up hurting my hand if I tried to like, I'd be I'd batter my hands black and blue, like it'd be just not even worth it. Like this geezer just it's incredible. You'd have to hear it, mate. It's just it's an echo. It's, it's like, decibels like, from my claps are just mad. Well, it's, Chloe is apparently saying that if we do hear that, we'll lose our ears. So I'm not mate, too it's sure ridiculous. Mate. Mate, it's horrible. As I said, I've never wanted to physically smash a geezer just for clapping her hands. Do you know what I mean? I've been around football fans fucking all my life. Do you know what I mean? This geezer here next to you. Oh, my God. You can go to the Emirates. You still hear me from the other side of the stadium. And that's just his house. Surprisingly, the there's only one minute of time added on, and the referee has just blown his whistle, Macaulay. And uh, at half time, it is by a nil. You like his name, didn't you? You, you, like, you like his name, is it? Macaulay. Yeah? You like this boy, didn't you, <laughs> Manny? Macaulay. <laughs> Macaulay. Reminds me, reminds me a bit of Claude Macaulay in a way, but uh, ah. different context, really. Claude. Claude. Right, guys. Any changes for you? Half time is here. Shouts out to all the real ones. Uh, Manny, your thoughts first, please. I don't think any changes are necessary. I think Rice and Georgie are working well. Tommy Asu seems to have settled into that role a little bit well. I mean, he hasn't really been cooked by Leroy Sané as of yet. Um, Not really. Would I bring? Would I bring Zinchenko on? I'm not too sure. I think Bayern do have some concerns. I think Lehmer was looking good, but he also ha has looked a bit slow. And I think Tuchel might decide to speed it up a little bit by bringing on someone like uh, maybe a Pavlo. No, Nyabri's injured. Oh, okay. Yeah, Nyabri's injured. And also, interestingly, it is half time at the empty hat, I think. No, they're still playing stoppages. But uh, Real Madrid is still 1 0 up. Rodrigo. And that makes me happy because I cannot stand those cities. Yeah, and you know what? And people say, oh, fuck it. It'll be better in the title race if they're still in the Champions League. No, they're not going to be playing us next. If it, like, yeah, fuck them off out of the competition, I reckon, mate. Uh, well, WB, what's uh, your thoughts? And what do you think should happen, if anything, in the second half? Manny says keep it the same. Um, WB? I, I said at least push up, push up a bit. You know, um, Martinelli and Saka, they're, they're getting two manned up. So I think another player should go up there with them when they go to attack. So then it's like two on two, not two on one. So, my, so hold on. Well, hold on. I was going to reply something else to that, actually, Manny. Love him or hate him, I believe if you took Havertz off and put Jesus on, an immediate work rate happens because you know this bastard, if anything, if nothing, he runs around a lot. So what I'm saying is he would come back into the midfield, give them a problem there, and where he is pretty nippy, I think he could maybe expose a couple of gaps. Now, I'm not no... Um, um, Jesus lover, but this game, I think he actually could um, possibly cause them a problem. Well, I'm being trusted on that 80th minute. I'm not talking about trust at the moment. I'm saying my first substitution. No, I know. I'm, 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 I'm saying bring him on and to remove, minute. remove probably about the 60th minute if it remains the same. I would remove Havertz and bring on Jesus for the simple reason as Jesus uh, Havertz has been shipped and Jesus will at least 
up the uh, tempo with a bit of work rate. I like that. I like that. I would bring Havertz off, except knowing Arteta as well as we do, he's not going to do that. Exactly. At least not in this, as, early, as early as the 60th minute. And I'll tell you what, if he brings on Zinchenko for anyone, I'm going to Yeah, that's just going to fuck him. Yeah, Tommy, just gonna you can't hit Tommy off. You'll take Tommy off. In Tommy. Ve- actually, do you know what? If Tommy gets skinned a couple of times in the second half, I could see him actually doing it. But um, because he does seem to like Zinny. I don't know. Zinny talks too much for me. I just don't like him. I don't like nothing about him. His personality, nothing. I don't know. He gets lost on the field. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. So sorry. I find him just a really annoying human being, innit? I don't like him. Um, will it get to a point in the game when we decide to shut up shop and play for penalties? I doubt it, bros. What I'm saying is if we get put under a lot of pressure. It would be more defensive-minded subs more than the attacking. As I'm saying, for me, remove Havertz, bring on Jesus for the simple fact that he'll give Bayern Munich something to think of with at least his running around and consistent work rate rather than goals. You know what I mean? Um, And that could help out. It could expose the space, hopefully, for Martinelli and Saka to maybe cut in and and fucking do something. What I'm saying is, Havertz, for me, has been shit again. That's all I'm saying in a nutshell. Sorry. Manny's off. Well, I'm well, other news. There's nine people watching us and only two likes. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Guys, come on, man. Stop listening. Stop hating. Can we grab a couple of likes on the video, please? Do be subscribing if we is new. Shouts out to all the real ones. Where is the real? Where is anyone from the group? Where is any of the UEs? Where are the bastards? Let me get to the group. You bastards. Where are you? Oh, my, oh yeah, fuck me. Hussein Juma's been here, though. So, bollocks. I'm wrong. Shouts out to Hussein, as always. Um, where's the bastard group? Oi, bastards! I'm gonna do a Phil special. Oi, bastards! Oi, bastards! Bastard. Oi, bastards! As Northern Life WB, fucking Northern, fucking Northern. All right, the best thing about Tamworth is Spud, man. Is it bollocks? I'd love to knock that. I'd grab him by his head, little fucking purple haired bastard. Anyway, nothing personal. By the way, um, Danny, if tomorrow I'm doing a watch along for the Aston Villa Lille game, if possible, um, would you be willing to um, hop on if you're watching the match? Of course I will. But the thing is, I'll be back late. I'm working. I think I'm doing 10 to 7. It'll be at our oh. home. Ah, oh, hold on, hold on. No, wait. Our home, 8 o'clock. Sort out the dog. I could be in just after 8, bros. The dog will have to get a quick walk because obviously he's going to be in all day. Yeah. In fact, hold like- on. But it, it's just an if, though, because if that match is being screened, you know, and and you are watching it, I would love to have you on. But so um, I'll jump on for you, Manny, mate. No problem. Yeah, uh, but it also depends on whether I will be having that screened, and I will inform you beforehand. I just think that in comparison to Liverpool and West Ham and Aston Villa, you know, Villa probably have the best chance of going through. West Ham are just too far behind. Uh, mate, the let's, say, let's, say, let's say it straight, Manny. Manny, Manny, stop lying, mate. Stop lying. Stop lying. We want to see Emery go through bollocks and we want to fucking stick it out to every Emery hater. <laughs> bollocks, have it right, Manny. <laughs> so we're doing Villa. Fuck me. If you talk about Phil and there he fucking is. How long ago did I say Phil's name? What, 30, 50 seconds ago, boys? I said West Philip. Ham and here he is. Um, you know? Phil, good evening to you. Oh, mate. my God. Oh. I just watched the advert and I saw a fucking spud man on screen fix advert. You are... Oh, these people are getting way too much attention. Spudman is on screw fix advert. By the way, Steven, Phil, how up. are you fancying your chances against uh, the Bundesliga Bro, champions? Do you know what tomorrow? I fancy? I fancy a wind up. West Ham to win one nil, but they'll be the first team to beat Borussia Mönchengladbach this season. Brat, 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 brat. Oh fuck me! How do I say this case? Oh, Bosco, what's going on, my brother? Stoke Newton's finest. Get a like on the video, brother. Yo, Danny, my brother, how you doing, mate? Been watching the game, and I think that Arsenal are playing. Um, Stoke the Newington. Football. Why does that sound familiar? Ah, oh, yes, a certain David O'Leary was born there. Was he really? Stoke Newington. Look it up on Wikipedia if you don't believe me. Fuck. Oh, D- David fucking O'Leary is born in fuck. I, s- I thought he was born in fucking Ireland. But anyway, uh, uh, I reckon we could nick a goal in the second half, brother. I reckon it's going penalties. Chloe said nil nil a minute ago. I was thinking. Bayern Munich are going to go 1-0 up. And we're going to nick a late, late equaliser. 
penalty shootouts to Ken. Well, I mean, we man. Shouts out to you, boss blah. My ears are ringing. Why? Yes, Spud Man is in an advert, babe. Bollocks to him. And shouts out to you, Loclo. I think we're going to win 3 0. I don't. I think you're going to win 1 0. Go out of the competition, but you will be able to say we are the only team that beat Bear Living. <laughs> Up. Fuck <laughs> me, I can't, I don't know who they are. Lever... <laughs> What's Leverkusen. Name, it is Leverkusen. Leverkusen. Fuck Leverkusen. Me, I, for... I was just getting the end to say, they beat Alonso. Do you know what I mean? Eh? <laughs> and Granite Shaka, don't forget. Yeah, Granite, the little bastard. I watched him in the press conference today. I could have punched him. Like I hear yesterday the boss wanted to watch Man City versus Real Madrid, but you was insisting on watching the Arsenal game. Have you got any comment? He goes, listen, man, we've got more than one TV. What can I say? <laughs> I thought, you little prick. Like, so basically, yeah, he still watches the Arsenal. And he's still probably thinking, fuck me, I'd be so much better in that midfield rather than the shite they've got alongside Declan Rice. He's probably that thinking, in the seven years that I was at Arsenal, if we had had a Declan Rice there, I'd have been a better footballer. He leaves and Declan joins. Chicken, what I mean? Everyone went silent like it was like, we miss Granite. That Martinelli fucking chance should have gone in. He's a bastard, isn't it? I could slap him from here to fucking... Hey, fucking listen, if you're going to criticise Martinelli for that, and I agree he deserves criticism, you also have to criticise Trossard. I take the point that the Villa defender was putting him under pressure, but, <laughs> you yeah, know, you still... You've st yeah. Yeah. I get it. I get it. The trust one's worse for me, bruv. Well done. No, 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 actually, I, I don't know. I, I, oh, I don't know. Well, yeah. Ben, no, ben White. Ben, ben White's chance in the first leg. Can't remember it, we man. One on one to the keeper, and all he does is kick that at him. He could have been oh, yeah. anywhere else. Could have lobbed him to the left, to the right, underneath him. Nope, like, straight to his chest. Uh, that just goes to show why ben, that, that just goes to show why Ben White's not a striker. He's a defender. <laughs> But why are you why are you in penalty box then trying to shoot then if you're not a striker? What the fuck are you doing up there? Mikel Arteta. I, I bet he didn't tell us to go up there though, did he? Probably How looking is... for a camera moment, maybe. I don't know. Um, he's doing what Ben White does, Phil. I don't know. No one's been um shockingly bad. Well, Havertz hasn't got into it. Uh, no one's been overly good, but we're nil nil. It's still a draw. Um, nothing bad has happened. Rare hasn't really been tested. A shot from 20 yards or something that was comfortably saved, even though his name is David. Um, not much to report in terms of chances, but it's not been a dead nil nil or, or overly cagey, as Manny said. It's been sort of open without the chance, or sort of an open game without fucking glorious chances. Absolutely. There was one chance from Maserati, but Ben White was able to deflect that behind for a corner. And uh, Kane, oh shit, Kane, 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 fuck me, it's been about a year and a half since I've seen you on here. You bollocks, come on, Brian. Uh, big on the second shelf, gang. <laughs> oh shit, do you remember, Wait. Bubby B, the, the archway? Hey. I can see what's on your the second shelf. Do you remember who he is, brothers? The geezer, like, don't start naming the company. The geezer that like, worked in that particular place, we went in it. Oh, 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 the Spurs, ah. the Spurs. Here. That, Spursy, there you go, yes. Uh, well, look, come on, Bayern. Spursy. Spursy. What's going on, Kane? Get a massive like on the video. Glorious to hear your beautiful voice. How are you doing, brother? You big lump of a Tottenham fan. I'm sure he had a totty ta uh, tattoo as well. Love the geezer, though. Yeah, Fucking I think he did. Wicked geezer. I think he did, didn't he? Yeah. Always, oh, made, me feel, always, always made me feel comfortable and at home. The way, the, that's the way you should fucking run at a fucking establishment, if you ask me. Shouts out to you, Kane. As the miss, who you got here? Sharon tonight, Tracy, Pauline, Dorothy. Who's with you? Rebecca. Rebecca. Bianca. <laughs> As it stands, we're out on away goals. What does that mean? Is away goals in Europa League? Over to you, Manny. No. No, exactly. there are no away. Uh, there exactly. are no away goals. There exactly. are no away goals. Yes, yeah, If there were, I agree, we'd be out. And if there were away goals, then, um, you know, Real Madrid would be up against it. But as oh, it get him. I thought he was talking West Ham tomorrow. Sorry. I actually, that's why I called him a bastard. Sorry. I get it now, Phil. Yeah. I thought he was talking about West Ham. would be all right. Oh, right. I thought you were talking about the, the Atby Amers, though. The Atby Amers. We ain't not out on away goals. <laughs> no. You, you idiot. If... 
if if this was I said Stones, you're out on away goals. Yes, yes, because if we drew nil nil and they they drew two two at the Emirates, bros, there's no extra time, there's no penalties. In last season's rules, we'd be out, we'd be out the competition. He's right, you fucking idiot. Yeah, yeah last yeah. year, not now. Yes, not now. Well done, mm, you bastard. You no, no, I believe I believe even last year we were in the Europa League, and by that by that logic, we would have gone through against Sporting Lisbon, but we didn't. It was the year before. I was I was at that London. game and. Do you know if didn't get injured? I was at the game right where he went down watching yeah. it. He did not get injured. It was calculated. It was for a, a whopping deal. And then Gabriel... John Salvo's from the halfway line. I could never, ever forgive Ramsdale for that. Couldn't save a single penalty uh, either. Keep though. doing your thing, Danny. I'm okay. um, with... <laughs> Being a ball, I'm going to call her tonight. Blood call, blood call. Penelope. No, I'm going to call her... Penel... Pen... Penal nipple and blue cool, blue cool. Nipple. <laughs> and you come on the big Harry Kane. You... Wait, I'm, I'm gonna be back man. in one second. Just go and toilet. I grew up in Hackney, Manny. No, I'm joking. Well, I did grow up in Manny, uh, in, Manny in Hackney, Manny. But yeah, um, how'd you say, ah, Manny? So you grew... Penelope. Penelope. I've never met a Penelope. How am I supposed to know a name like Penelope? Penelope Cruz. I don't watch movies. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm joking. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. if, you grew up in, if you grew up in Hackney, obviously you should have had a lot of West Ham mates around your neck of the woods. Not really. It was all Arsenal. Couple of the scum. Couple of, couple of Kane, eh? Couple of Canes. Do you know Ooh. what I mean? Yeah. No no West Ham fans, man. They were like extinct. I don't know. Yeah, you have to I've go got, deep got... into East London, bro, before you see a hammer like that. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, you have to get yeah. down them side. Dagenham. I got, you know I, I mean? I got some close there. family friends who live in East Ham, which is a little bit further away from the uh, for what was formerly uh, the Berlin Ground, Upton Park. It's actually just before Barking on the district line. So um, not too far away from there, I would imagine. Shouts out to you, Kane. Always a gentleman. Bloco, bloco. Cam's in the building. Shouts out to you, bro. What's going on? We've got your best pal, WB, on tonight. <laughs> He's been on his best behavior. Shouts out to WB. We've got Manny, as you can see. And you've got beautiful blue eyes, Danny, ASC TV. Uh, we're and, all good. The, the thing about Khan and me is that we always have time for one another. I love his reply to my one of my more recent tweets. Mate, you're a real one. Give my best to Gem, all right? Beautiful. Um, and yeah, I could be following Manny. I'm on, on a stream tomorrow. I don't know where at. Don't know what 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 channel, but I'll be with Manny tomorrow. I will. I will get. I will give you the details and uh, let it happen. I mean, I don't even know if we're going to have that match being streamed for some reason because my sports some um, broadcaster normally prefers the Europa League over the Conference League. But sometimes I have seen Aston Villa play. They might decide to prioritise Aston Villa if they have a better chance of we going. We could do through. something different, Manny. We could just we'll just do a Europa League game. And what I'll do is. I'll just slyly have the Villa game on and I'll be just sort of um, slyly, yeah, you know what you do. I'll, I'll be commentating on that in bits and you'll be looking at uh, the other Europa. Yeah, I see. <laughs> what, do, do you see WB? Of course, Manny. Much love, brother. Of PC Cam. Cam. PC, <laughs> here we go. Yeah, and Arsenal have just uh, kicked off and David Raya kicking it forward, sending it forward. Still nil-nil. 45 minutes separates um, either of these teams from a semi-final. And, and guys, I remember, shoot, at the Etihad like. Stadium, it is Manchester Clitty, nil. Real Madrid, one. Rodrigo, the scorer. Rodrigo, the gunner. Next season, hopefully. He will not be. Bro, we need a winger. We need a winger badly. Oh, my phone's going to die. Oops. If it does, we'll give it a charge or put something in. Guys, do be yeah, liking, do be subscribing. I'm going to plug you in now. Come on, boys. 45 minutes. I reckon this could go all the way to penalties. It could, but uh, we'll see what happens. Bayern going down the rise. So, oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck me, man. Bayern very nearly with uh, some chances there. A glancing header which hit the uh, crossbar. And I believe that might have been, um, I don't know if that was Kimmich, it was left footed, but no, it's actually Guerrero. Take a look at this. I don't know if Kane was marginally Wait, on the side or not, but. And it okay. wasn't even it's Kane, it was Goretzka with the header. It was Goretzka with the header there. Directed okay. well. Rea was beaten hook, line, and sicker. Fuck's sake. 
I've told sorry, I've totally went out to a different fucking link and I'm only at the kickoff now. It's a now. corner though, actually. It's a corner. Go go to Kim number one. Taking it. Fuck off. Sorry. I'm gonna try number the one. Arsenal channel. Is... No, I'm gonna try the Arsenal channel, Stephen. Sorry, leave me alone. It's gonna piss me off, bro. Do you know what I'm like? Just leave me alone. <laughs> fucking bastards. Kimmich with the corner, right footed in swinger. Just taking it right now, hoping to get it high, chipped beautifully. But um, I believe oh! Gabriel who met that with a header. Oh, that was close. And Maserau is down after a foul by Martinelli. Ray, I count your chickens lucky, man. And that's offside anyway. Yep. There wasn't. <clears throat> I can just imagine opposition fans singing this song. You can shove your David Ray up your ass. You can shove your David Ray up your ass. Definitely Brentford fans. You can shove fans, your David Ray, a most overrated player. Shove your David Ray up your ass. That's beautiful, Manny. Manny, Manny, Manny. How about that for a header, though? Goretzka, seriously. Very Oh, oh fuck for me. me. Top corner. Hold on, let me Top just see bins, how I'm doing. as we would say. Dan, you're about a minute behind me now. Blood clot. Is it just me, or is there something about David Raya that makes you think this guy's a bit of a uh, scary Shit cat? Hunt. Um, brother, let me round this up for you. David Raya. Obviously, never got attention from Spain or any big club in his life. He isn't exactly the youngest geyser in the world. Um, he was at a very, very small pond in Brentford. And if you look at the stats, like if you look at Sky Opta stats, for instance, yeah, there's not many Arsenal players that are at the top of anything. All right, Saka is. Uh, Saliba, of course, is like in the best defender or most passes, whatever. But I'm talking when you think of like the goalkeepers that are rated the best. Basically, the, the goalkeepers that for me, get the most shots hit at them or they're the most consistent savers. Anana's up there and people say he's shit. Uh, Pickford's up there people say he's shit. Um, Wait, Anana's up there because Man United's defence is shit. Okay, that's that, Stephen. I did say that at the start, though. Like, it could be because they're consistently getting peppered and they're the ones more likely to have the shots to save. What I'm saying is you don't catch David Rea at the top of these things like for clean sheets or blah, blah, blah or man and match awards. I'm just saying he isn't I don't know, Manny probably, I think, and I'm pretty sure he um, put a big like He's in it. He's not however. influential. He's not influential. I basically just put Arteta out. I put a picture up on Twitter the other day. Arteta out. It should have got thousands of fucking views and attention, but it's me, innit? Arteta out and basically just put, who the fuck sells Martinez for 17 million quid and spends the best part of 60 million on two fucking goalkeepers that ain't nowhere near his quality? Who does that? Yeah, but there was another tweet which I uh, sort of put up. It was actually a quote tweet where people were talking about how Martinez has evolved into a sweeper keeper. So ironically, you know, with his ball playing from the back having improved, he'd uh, still Tommy's be a pretty good fit for Arteta. Sorry? Tommy's contact lens has come out. Wow. And sorry, uh, well, there man, should yeah. Be, there, should be, there should be a rule. If you want to wear contact lenses, you've got to wear some swimming goggles as protection. Oh, shit. If I could show you that image, bros. Oh, my God. Cam, you're really scaring me, bros. <laughs> Is that you? <laughs> I'm sure that is Cam. Is that you, Cam? That is you, Cam. That is Cam. It can't be just any bald head white gazer, I'm telling you. Bollocks. I don't mean boarded with um Ooh, Saka, this is looking good. But um yep, still Saka. Come on, Martin. And there's the Tommy gun. Contact lenses and all. And Kimmich nips takes up takes that away from him, and that'll be a throw. Yeah, that's me. 
blood. Oh my god, if I could just show like WB that um picture right now, I think it'll start shaking. You might you might jump he might jump off, put it in the group. I ain't got Cam Smith, I might just put it in the group. <laughs> 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 and Cam, you can't delete it now. I got one of them iPhone like one hundreds. I didn't got an iPhone fifteen, I got iPhone one hundred and four. Yes, Tommy, beautiful stuff. But once again, excellent defending from Bayern. And that's the problem, you know. <laughs> Against Aston Villa, we were doing a lot of good pressing, but Diego Carlos and Pau Torres, their defending was absolutely spot on. And even a few others were coming back to help out. And eventually, you know, we just Ooh. couldn't um, get anything past them. And, Shit, guys, uh, you I know, might have a glitch. Guys, 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 before I cut. Oh, I thought I was going to have an internet problem. My TV just froze for a second. Show him. All right, cool. Put it in the group. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, Manny, I'll have to send it to you in a sec. I will, Cam can send it to you. Oh, it's beautiful, this picture. Where's the group? You cunts. Uh, PC Cam. PC Cam. I think you will reply to this first. Fuck me. Oh, it's on Cam's story on Instagram, and Lee Gunner's the very first prick I see on Cam's story because he must look at it. Oh, wow. God. Ugh. Ugh. Sorry, Cam. But yeah. Ugh. Ugh. Manny will tell you straight about fucking that Gunner cunt. He'll tell you he's yeah. a knob. He'll tell you he's a fucking knob. Where's the LTA tonight? Don't know. The LTA said he's coming. But oh, there's the LTA. He's the first to reply to it. <laughs> cunt is the word. <laughs> Have you seen the picture, WB, you big cunt? Oh, you can't. Oh, wait, let me look. Let me, let me try and look. It might kick me out. It might not. All right, sweet. Whatever. It's worth looking. It's worth a kick out. <laughs> oh, my God. I see it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just heard. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my fucking God. <laughs> It's brilliant, isn't it? Let's go it look at like... Hold on, I'm having a glitch again. Boys, if I have a glitch, I'll be straight back. Can no, I just says playback error? Okay. I don't like this link. All right, let's fuck off this link. Go That's on to glorious. number two. Stephen, the shut the link. fuck up with you. Sorry, I don't okay. mean an horrible way. Oh, oh yes, look what I've just done. Brilliantly. Doing it, turning on the player and... Go on, so I can pass it. So I can pass it. Oh... What? How is that not a corner? It's a goal kick. Saka had the last touch. Good decision from the linesman. Slow, but uh, Odegaard there slow turning slow. and twisting Lehmer around. And um, I'll tell you what, Lehmer was impressive in the first leg at the Emirates, but this time around he's looked a little bit slow and ponderous in a way. And he's just been booked, so I wouldn't be surprised if Tuchel takes him off and brings on another midfielder. Guys, have any of, be... any, has, has Florian Rutz come to any of you boys' attention recently? Because I've been speaking about this guy for a minute. I don't know if any of you have heard me personally, but I've been talking about Florian R hat tricks the other day. Fucking three glorious goals. Oh, I don't know. No, Rutz is quality. I think he also plays well for Germany. He and, does. Uh... He does. He does very well. And, of course, um, it was his hat-trick that, of course, confirmed uh, the Bundesliga going to Leverkusen. Exactly. It certainly was. When you've got all that big match experience of Manuel Neuer, nothing can phase you. But, uh, yep, uh, straight out to Maserawi on the left. And Saka doing brilliantly to dispossess him there. Now, Deki. That's it, Deki. Run, run, run. <laughs> Dyer forcing him back, though. Saliba joining the party. And now we've got Georgie. Porgy. Let's pick George. Magalaj. Martinelli. Oh, nearly a chance there, but it's still with us. Havertz wasn't able to get on the end of that. Had he, it would have been a certain goal. It is with Havertz now, though, laying it back for Odegaard, but uh, running into the bind defence like a train, hitting the buffers. Away now through Goretzka. Georgie winning it back brilliantly with Saka now. And this is so this is probably the best uh, best I've seen Rice and Georgie play together in a long time. Georgie might not have the legs anymore, but when it comes to these big games, he does uh, produce. Again, Manny, I think you've said it. You've mentioned Neuer a couple of times in experience. If Jorginho does have one thing, he does have um, 
decent match day. Right on Great ball. The thing is, though, that um, Georgie was the guy who cost um, Italy qualification for the World Cup. Um, I'm sure a lot of clubs would have considered him to be cursed in a way. What are you talking about against? Was it Liechtenstein or whatever? Oh, what, what, what? Gabby, you absolute bozo. You What's Gabby lucky, done now? Lucky boy. Uh, Steve will watch it and tell you. Give me, give me 20 seconds. I'm, I'm <laughs> there. I'll be there before Danny will. Come on, we're playing decent here. This is decent from what I'm Georgie. seeing. Gone, Declan lost the ball. Gone, it should be right now, right? Okay. He is so far away from the ball. Come on. Okay. He's near the ball now. He's near the ball. Fuck's sake. Uh, Manny, minute Come check, on. please. 57, 22, 23, 24. And a corner yeah. taken by Kimmich headed away, but it is back with Mazarawi now. I can recognize him with his beard. And that's going to go out of play, and that'll be a goal kick. But there's a reason why we talk about the bozo gene. What Gabriel was thinking, I don't know. He's very lucky that it didn't. <gasps> oh! 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 I told you. I told you. I told you. Fuck you. Sorry, I'm looking at links, guys. I'm just trying <laughs> to fucking speed up a bit. Fuck off. <laughs> What's the matter, Stevie? Can I got your tongue? <laughs> oh my god, that was close. <sighs> so we've had two guilted chances, yeah. I I don't know. The first I part. don't know whether to celebrate a, a, a good defence or a fuck you because you nearly scored that own goal. Oh, what, that the Gabriel? Good. What? Yeah. Oh, I'm watching it. Fuck me. So, hold on. What minute are we on, bastards? Sorry. 57. I'm, I'm on 57. 57. 58, I'm on. 58, 40, right, 51, I'm on 57, 40, 20. 57, 20. Oh, you've, gone about... you've gone past it. You've gone past it. I know. I've just, I've just... I said I've just watched it. You oh. I mean, he was, he was obviously trying to pass it back time. to... Uh, oh, Kai, 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 you tried, son, you tried. Okay, so about 60th minute, you tried something. That wasn't poor defending. I mean, the pass back was a bit too, um, too hard. He uh, literally um, bypassed David Ray, and had that been, you know... Um, you know, a little bit um, further to um, have a bit a bit closer to Ray. Actually, would have gone in the goal. Gabriel Magalias, you lucky, lucky, lucky so and so. Oh, for fuck's sakes! Sane's got an injury, but he's still managing to get the better of both Martinelli and Tomiyasu. Let me just silence my phone, sorry, people. Let me just silence my bastard phone. Come on, Arsenal. Don't get caught out of like an 89th minute goal, please. Just uh, clock to now. Let me see what's happening at the empty had. Still 1 0 Real Madrid. Oh, boy. Madrid. Fuza Madrid. I believe it's Hala Madrid, but whatever. And Guerrero bringing I know it down is. the Tommy Gun. It's, Forza, that it's Forza be... Milan. I know. But uh, the referee waves play on. No foul there. So some good work from the. Uh, by and left winger. It's so good that you can't hear what Chloe's doing right now. She is fucking snoring down the house. She's making the house vibrate from her snoring. But Mazarari dis dispossessing Rice. Actually, that was Musiala who dis dispossessed him. My bad. Oh, a chance for Goretzka, but that should go for a corner off for uh, Gabriel. Bayern applying some good pressure now on the hour. No, excellent work from Guerrero. He got the ball first. And, I say it's uh, time for Havertz to fuck off. You and me both, mate. You and me both. 
I mean, I'd, I'd love him to fuck off from the club, but I mean, directly from this game now and bring on uh, Hazus. Yep. Go on, big Tom. Run. Oh, we that's a foul. That's no, a foul. It's not, it's, not, it's not. It's not. He got the ball first. Guerrero, right? He got the ball first. So Kimmich once again with the corner. Bayern seventh, and we haven't had a single one yet. And that was a waste. Straight over. Mr. All right. The ball. Tommy, Mickey, make your substitutions. Yeah, don't give them the ball back. Let them go. Leave it. Ooh, boy. <clears throat> Wait, so you can take a player out and get the ball at the same time and it's not a foul. Sorry, guys. Let me jump off my phone. Fucking bollocks. No, that's not a foul there. Saka <sighs> clearly tried to dive against Maserati, but Maserati was wise to him. <laughs> Lema receiving the ball from Maserati, but Odegaard once again nearly getting it off him. Lema moving away from him. Odegaard's had a wonderful game tonight. He certainly tried to put in the share of tackles as well. Did he just I mean, try to score about... from the, the corner? I don't think he did. And uh, Raya tipping that away. And Bayer, oh boy. No. It just had to be Joshua Kimmich. 63 no. minutes. Fuck you. Fuck off. So, Bayern against Real Madrid. Carlo Ancelotti against uh, one of his... I told clubs. you, man, it's a jinx. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off, Steve. I told you not now. Fuck off, Steve, you. you wank. You. Yeah, tell him, Manny. You... You're like, bastard. <laughs> Just, it's too much for a gentleman Manny, to when say. You're not, when, when you're not in the stream, we win. What else do you want to say? Evidence is there. Manny, back it up. We must have had some good wins of you. Come on. Yeah, come on. I mean, like, we beat Lons 4-0, didn't we? We also smacked in PSV. PSV. Oh, yeah, all right. I'm yeah. pretty certain we um, uh, beat uh, Sevilla. And, of course, there was the... Uh, oh, what's the goal? Where we went through. Oh, my God. Joshua <sighs> Kimmich. And that is what, how you use your head. Literally. But uh, it had been coming, and now we've got it all to do with about 26 minutes plus stoppages left. Right. Can we get Havertz to fuck off? Can let's get Jesus on a fuck immediately. Arteta out, you fat bastard. Shouts out to you, Hussein. I blame yep. Saliba. Good work from Guerrero there. And uh, once again, the Germans I blame seem you, to be WB, your fat cunt. All of the... How's that? And I'll tell How you what, I thought Four later coming five years. was having Nothing. a bit of a struggle, a but he looks like a man possessed now. Sané in the penalty area. And uh, is that Kimmich, I think? We'll find out. It might be. Kimbich. Kimbich. Wait, he, he was tracking him. It's like Martinelli tracking him. I don't, I don't think it was. It wasn't, it wasn't. He wasn't tracking Kimmich. He was tracking him. It was Great him. Now. It was, was him, number 11. Now. In the penalty area. Oh, boy. And uh, Sané with his wrong foot. His left foot is not his right foot, <laughs> it's his right foot. I'll never get Joshua Kimmich, one goal in ten matches. Great work down the left, and that should have been a goal, but uh, needed someone left footed to get on the end of that, not Leroy Sané. Oh, come on. Mickey, make your substitutions, Mickey. You're a Mickey Mouse manager. You don't belong at this club. The group is now going to kick into play. Screw you, Phil. Free Arsenal. You know that, ain't it? <laughs> oh, Mickey, you're a swine. You're a swine. You mess with our mind. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. You're a swine. 
hey, Mickey, I told all of the people on Danny AFC all the time that you were a loser and a swine. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Manny, I'm, I'm good at this shit. Come, let's do wordplay. No, I'm not saying against you. I'm just saying, like, yeah. Oh, Mickey, you that blew could, my that mind. That could have been 2 0. Because you're, you're dirty from the spine. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. Now that's a foul and uh, the Bayern free kick. At least send it to extra time if you can't win it. And a yellow card being issued. One of the assistant coaches has gotten it. I wonder who. Airport Dave. Well, we're both going to get what we wanted. Jesus and Trossard coming on. Please let it be Havertz coming off. Oh, no. It's I'm Georgie. Martinelli. Georgie Porgy. And Martinelli. And Havertz, the donkey, yep. is still on. You absolute waster. You waster. Tell me that again slowly, Manny, because I couldn't process it. Havertz on. Staying on. Jesus for Martinelli. And Georgie for... Wow, it's written into why his contract. Would you take, why would you take off Jorginho when he's literally been having an impressive game tonight? Hardly put a foot wrong. And now Odegaard's uh, com Trossard's first touch to commit a foul there, rather. And that will be another buy and free kick. All right, Loco. D Buzz, this Loco's come back ill, you know. I told you this whole choking and coughing thing, isn't it? Look, I'll go sit down, please. I'll deal with you after, man. Free Arsenal. I love that. Sixty-eight minutes, even. Bayern one, Arsenal nil, three-two on aggregate. Into the I said, I said well, anyway. Well, listen, let's be honest, one. boys. I said at half time we're going to go one nil down, and we're going to nickelate late equaliser. What it was. Now I've actually called it on. Let's see what the fuck happens. Fuck sakes. And in other news, it's still 1-0 to Real Madrid. City can't score. Not even in their own home. Oh, if they get denied a treble tonight, that would make me very happy. Yeah. Not as happy as um, I would be if Arsenal were to somehow pull the chestnuts out of the fire and win, of course, but... Uh... Manny, who do you support? Fuck off, Stephen. What are we talking about? I was asking you who do you support. I support England and Arsenal. Okay. Stephen, I know you're pissed off. Why would you suggest that Manny's <laughs> no, 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 I know you're pissed off. I'm pissed off. I'm speechless, yeah? But are you just saying he's a teacher because he's a secret Spurs fan, yeah? We're yeah. losing. Like, what are you yeah. getting at? Yeah, oh, you fucking well, I'm... bastard. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Oh, I love you, you Stephen, but fuck me. Yeah, you prat, you numpty, you muppet, <laughs> you killer. <laughs> You waster. Don't start you, him, you, Manny. You. Manny, Manny, you're going to open a can of worms. Just leave him alone because he's just going to come back. <laughs> just stop, Manny, and just... Yeah, no, but here's the thing. The words the words I'm using are nowhere near as foul mouth. Oh, I, I know, I know, I know. But um, WB don't need ammo. That's, 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 just, 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 just trust me. I don't know And again, I've already had a word of him before you come on the stream. Like, are you coming on to behave, son? Yeah, like I told him. <laughs> To call, like, Manny, have I ever to call you? Manny, have I ever called you before a stream and said, Manny, I need you to behave today? You know what I mean? Don't no, say shit or never, fuck. Yeah. You've never, I, well, you've I, never I, I felt I had to with WB today. Best friend or not. Like, are you coming on to fuck with me or is it personal with Manny? Ah, I was like, listen to me. Shush. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can't come on. And then I had to threaten with, threaten him with, listen, I'll just, I'll just take, hit the fucking remove you button. So he's behaved. I had to think about it for a two minutes. That's because I respect you so much, Manny. I said you're not coming on just to be naughty to Manny, mate. <laughs> yeah, thank well, you very much indeed for looking out for me. Always, Manny. Always, Manny. I can't I can't be two-faced. Oh. I mean, if I say you're the European partner of Danny ASC TV, you're the European fucking... <laughs> Jinx. <God. laughs> 
<laughs> and he's, he's, he's going to keep saying it, bruv. Seriously, he's going to. Oh, just... Sane doing some brilliant work there. But Manny, do you know what I'm going to do? When we though, and this time Saliba hoiks it over, left footed for a corner. Manny, I'm going to do Danny. Manny, I'm going to do yeah. Danny Optostat. See, I'm going to go look back at all of our streams. It can't be that hard to find because we do European games, yeah. I'm going to go and see our stats here from win, lose, draw. <laughs> We've lost more with money in than we have won. We don't do brilliant in Europe. Yeah. The money's in the box. With, with or without me. That's actually, we just don't do well in yeah, Europe. Yeah, as you two would say, we don't win with or without me. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. I know that song. You too, with or without you. Oh, fuck me, yeah. When <laughs> Irish is a smoke. Yeah, I was about to say next. My brother likes them bastards, whoever they are. I just knew it because my brother would say something like that. My brother loved you too, innit? Yeah. I take it he still hasn't found what he's looking for. <laughs> he actually hasn't. <laughs> Brilliant. Brilliant. You found the local kebab shop. Yes, yes. Oh, that's good. I'm just glad he's not wandering around where the streets have no name. Oh, fuck me, man. You're good. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. I'm going to come with one then. One love. I was waiting. <laughs> <laughs> one life. Our tether, you're causing Arsenal strife. We're one. Beautiful. Yeah, but we're not the same. When it's Ben White or Key War again, I say, Arsenal, oh, so you're better. Emery's a real G. <laughs> anyway, Manny, don't get me started. <laughs> What's another U2 classic? Hold on. I think your thing is work Chloe up. Teta fucking Teta <laughs> Teta fucking Teta Down 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 that's a bit political down 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 Sunday bloody Sunday yeah. I said our Teta was a prick I even said he would take it in his in the sticks How long how long are we gonna see this prick all right, so foot, corner to Arsenal, our first year. of the night. Saka, left footed, in swinger. This should be good. Can he get Don't it in? Magalaj, the way. usual suspect, should be up there. And it goes over everyone. And I think uh, Noya pretty much put that out for another corner. So you got two in quick succession after not having a single one for the first 72 minutes. Manny, I see a freestyle coming up. Sunday, bloody Sunday. Yeah, it's going to be the instrumental here, and I'm going to be going out there differently. Yeah. The problem, the problem is, in this case, it should be Wednesday, bloody Wednesday. But it would have been perfect for the Aston Villa game. Sunday, bloody Sunday, indeed. Yeah. Ooh, foul, I think, in, um, in the penalty. Oh, well, just don't let Matt... Man, I can see Man City coming back and winning 2-1. Sorry to have jinxed it, but I see it happening. And you know what? Finally, Tuchel has taken the hint. He decided to take off Maserawi and bring on Min J Kim. Quality <laughs> defender, as you and I both agree. I'm getting pissed off here. Fuck me. Oh, UE's in the fucking group. Go on, tell me something. Tell me something I and, don't know. Uh, <laughs> tell me something I don't great, know. Great shift by Maserawi tonight. Done really well in the left back position, but moving forward, he's also done well. And Min Jae Kim will be coming on for the last 15 minutes to try to tighten everything up. Good call by Tuchel. Oh. But the Moroccan's done well tonight. All thrown stuff like that. You could say the Moroccan has been rocking. You can say Arsenal are oh, wank. Oh, Arteta. So, uh, I'm distraught, people, man. This is fucking bollocks. And, uh, Why does Ben White do that on every corner? He always has to push the keeper. And uh, Arsenal win, a, a, Bayern rather, with another corner. Musiala doing some great work on his own. We just haven't been able to keep him quiet tonight, and that's the worst part. He is one of their more skilled players. 
In fact, Tuchel has moved Seattle to thank, thank for that Bundesliga win. Um, oh, bollocks, man. Fuck off, bollocks, you're a cunt. I'm fucking pissed. I am fucking pissed. And you haven't even had a drink. No, yeah, no, how... yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, literally, yeah. So it looks as though Min J Kim has settled back into the defense and it shit, man. I'm not gonna mention that... names, but I'm getting emotional text messages from very respectful people. Like, I'm done with this club, I'm not even gonna watch them. He's actually oh shit, Stephen, he's put it on the group. Wow. Literally Who's take Lee? care. No, go look at the group, you fucking... Right, he's left the group. The he's up. left the group. What the fuck? Hey. Hey. Joe Mother. Uh, what? Uh. He'll be back tomorrow. Yeah, let's, let's not lose face. There's about 13 minutes left, plus stoppages. We get a goal. We can force them to extra time. Maybe if Bayern start to uh, drop their heads a bit. Foul by Min Jae Kim on Saka, and that'll be a free kick. So something could happen. You just never know. It's never over until the final whistle. Not the best of touches there from Min Jae Kim. It was all about the super subs um, in the earlier legs, but this time the subs have been anything but super. Fuck me, Juma. Fucking bombshell. He's telling me it ain't me or la la la. He just have I froze? Hello? Me? I'm not, yeah, I know. I can't see all me. Right. Odegaard with the free kick into the penalty area. Yeah, and uh, that's allowed to go all the way. Manny, out. I'm gonna no have to jump in and out. Manny, Manny, I have to jump in and out. My stream is froze. Bollocks. All right. You, you no, do wait, that. Wait. Still... no, no, wait, wait, wait. Stay there, Manny, because hold on. I've got a worse problem. It's my computer's. Yeah. Guys, I'll be back in 30 seconds. The computer's having a breakdown. Let me take the charger out. Right. It's doing this recently. I'm going to sack this computer. To... Hold on. It's come back. Am I here? Yo, yeah, you're here. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, fuck. You can Perfect. see me Perfect. as well. Right. Do you know what it is, Stephen? I, just, I took the charger out. Yeah, don't worry, man. It's just, yeah. I took the charger is out. It, is it the old days where you, where you have to unplug the camera for it to work? No, no, nothing and, like that, uh, man. I just think the apple's on the way out, bro. So that's I've all. got, I've got to give the uh, a two good credit for not bringing on Dai after Pamecano. How that idiot starts for France ahead of William Saliba, I will never know. But uh, it's, like... it's normally him and Kanate ahead of Saliba. I get that um, Deschamps has had a far more stellar playing career and is um, a more successful manager, but uh, you know. Oh my God! What was that, man? That was a free kick chipped into the area, and it went beyond everyone. Coming up to ten minutes left. I can't believe Zoom has just left. He's just. Did you none of you hear the voice now? I just played the voice now. Uh, you like, I've just got no energy for this club. It's been the same since two thousand three, two thousand and four. History is just repeating itself. Fuck off, bollocks! I'm out. Oh, wait, this could be good. Oh, it's 1-1. 1-1. One, one. Oh, one, one. Oh, no, no. Juma, where the fuck have you gone, bruvs? No, it's not 1-1. One, one. It's not 1-1. One, one. It's not 1-1. One, one. Jesus had a... For Man City. Chance, but I think... For Man City. And Real Madrid is 1-1. One, oh. one. You prick. Why are you clapping them hands of yours, bruvs? Do you want louder? Fucking well, clap like hands. could go to extra time. I told you. They're going to win 2-1 in it. They're going to win 2 1, guys. I'm going to tell you straight. I seriously hope they don't. I can't stand those guys. But uh, having said that, I would fancy my chances against uh, City more. I mean, uh, City more than Madrid. But. Uh, don't you find it weird? We always get Bayern Munich at this stage. No one else. Um. Look, it's just uh, written. I mean, Barcelona and PSG almost perpetually meet. And. We saw PSG finally break the Barca curse, and who yeah, better yeah. than the former Barcelona manager to break that curse? Yeah, Luis Enrique, and very, very professional in his fucking whole... Uh, hey, Zeus! What are you doing? 
I'm so confused about this Juma thing, bros. Why did you leave? Like, you fucking bastard, Jesus. You absolute wanker. Like, do you know what? Do you know what? I'm feeling emotional like Juma now. Fuck me. Got pressure to keep her. You should stand there and just watch him keep the ball away. <sighs> okay, buy and throw now. Luciala again. What a fine player he is. Could have played for England, but has opted to represent Germany. Dickhead. Could you blame him? Um. Yeah. There we'll we go, Leif. That'll, that'll give us something. Paul Merson. <laughs> <laughs> Paul Merson. <laughs> <laughs> I'd wait for that. I'd need a single set of it. No uh, get the fucker out. Oh, the leech. Let's see what's going to happen. He's the skill there. Lee, Guerrero, Lee. back heel through the legs to Musiala. But this time the defence prevents Musiala from finding Kane. I swear, Bayern are just playing the more attractive football tonight. Welcome, we Lee. I mean, I, I know that Tuchel is um, very much an overrated coach, but uh, I have to give him his props tonight. He has been... He has so far outcoached um, Arsenal, and uh, he's done a good job tonight. Not as good as that, the job Emery did on us uh, did on us on Sunday, but uh, good enough to potentially win. But we still have seven minutes to at least force the match into extra time. And uh, by the way, quick question, Danny boy: If uh, Madrid and City go to extra time, you're going to stay on and watch it, or are you going to end yep. the stream? Yep, let's, let's do it. Wow. You are going all out tonight. I love it. it. And you're staying you in the drink, room, yeah. Fuck you, Stephen, if I slap you from here to fucking Northern Land. I'm <laughs> so pissed off, man. Yeah, he might, he might, um, uh, g um, you know, give you a, an absolute beating all the way from where you are, all the way to Cockfosters. Beating. <laughs> beating. <laughs> beating. There you go. So, again, that was a... Stephen said, basically, if you wonder why we practiced that twice, Stephen said it one day. I don't feel it was on a show. I was one beating is the way he said it. Beating. <laughs> Bubs, do you, do, beating. Do, do when you put a fucking, like... Do you know when you... Right, there's a way you can say, look at you, cunt, or look at you, cunt. Like, you can say it with authority. The way he said beating, it was, it was like... It was beating. half authority, half with a, like... Oh, it was brilliant. Like, I don't know, you had to be there. Do you know what I mean? This is going to make no sense to you either. Choo -choo, you just had to be there. Do you know what I mean? Uh, yeah. I, made a grow, I, made a grow, I made a grown woman cry. Hello, I didn't a soft up. I just, I heard a train go by. Choo -choo, and I just repeated, choo -choo. are you mugging me off? I was like, ah? World War Three. WB laughed. Was it an ashtray to come through at me, Stephen? Because remember, it was a chip out the wall. It, it, yeah, it was something. <laughs> it was, it was a chip out the wall. She threw it so aggressively. But you remember the chip out? It was a I went, fuck me if that hit my head, you cunt. <laughs> you called me like, I hate the C word. Cunt. Here you go. Shut up, Stephen. <laughs> I remember, Stephen, oh, hey, so Sue, most people should look at the girl's there. face and think he's here. I, you know I looked for right you to see how funny hey, you he found it. He does lend a great off. deal. He can't shoot the top. <laughs> but then, I mean, I listen, if he's, able, if, if he's able to move around really well, but still can't shoot or score for Toffee, why is he a striker? Who the fuck are you talking about? Jesus, probably. Hey, yeah, Jesus, yes. yes. And he's just so hold on, he could be, there hold on. don't worry. Mikel the Great could make him an inverted... Wing back next season. Because Inverted. Worked Inverted. Right. Inverted. Oh, no. Why did so I? Arsenal have that? Chelsea and then Bournemouth. Oh, by the way, guys, I never tweet I put out there. Yeah? Oh. We, like to, we like to support Chelsea and we like to finance oh, them way, season in, season out. There's Tommy Asu coming off. Edward and Ketty are coming on. Three at the back. Unless he that. plans on putting him. Oh, God. Of all the people to bring on. 
Bayern's defence will not be in trouble with their Well, look at this, though, Sophie. What do you mean, stop biting my nails? Like, what's the. You're not sending out like a. Like, oh, God, look at what we're doing. Do you want me to cry on the stream? Sophie fucking Rose. Sophie Rose. How you doing, lass? You know, you know that, here, here's something as well. Obviously, both of you will Let's remember the five again. ones. But there's a part of me that thinks that if we were to lose tonight, this might hurt even more. Because we should have done a lot more. Well, no, George, let me tell you straight, Manny. I'm going to answer your question. And Mr. Jahal will know what I'm saying. The five ones was inflicted on us by a different kind of Bayern Munich team, bros. A fucking machine of a Bayern Munich team. No disrespect oh, to yes. Luciola or Sane or any motherfucker that's out there. But Prime Neuer was there. And Neuer's still there. Well done. I'm saying... This was a different team. Plus, Wenger had probably, I don't know, a Bowie playing. He probably had fucking Cockerlan playing. Again. Oh, fuck about. I agree, and that's why this, this is a Bayern Munich just fucking lost the league title to who? Bayern fucking Levin fucking Quasen. <laughs> Sorry. Do you know what I mean? Who? Eh? Have they even won the Bundes Bastard League before? No, no, no. That's the first to... ever time. Shouts out to you, Jahal. So it's either Alonso's a fucking genius, yeah? Or but listen, fucking... great. Wait, Odegaard's claiming that should be a corner, but instead it's a goal kick. Great work from him, doing well um, to get past Min Jae Kim, but take a look at this. Great work from the captain there. I think he's claiming that Dyer got the last, Noya got the last touch, but. Uh... Oh, goodness, yeah, we've been I'm, wrong. I'm How watching their that? attack right now. How do you call that a, go a goal kick? Was there an offside in the build-up? I don't know. I take it we're switching over to the Etty Fuck Arena, Amani. Are you staying with us, WB? Yeah, if you want. And now he brings on a Pamecano. Are you kidding me, Tuchel? You got six in the back. Got Pamecano and Kim not in the fucking starting line, but fucking diabolical is. Ah, oh, do you know what? No, oh, I'll tell you gosh. why. Because Apamecano is rubbish. Min J Kim might have had a bit of a falling out with Tuchel. But now he brings on two central defenders to try to close things out. How that affects the formation, I don't know. It's clear that Bayern are going to try and shut up shop. But I don't know how many minutes of stoppage time are going to be added. So that is a big risk that Tuchel's taking. But... Uh... What's that mean, Ajahn Arby? Shouts out to all the Rowans. Do be liking, do be subscribing. I'm disgusted. This ain't the greatest buying. Oh, wait, that should be a fucking corner, man. It should be a corner. You're right. I just hope that nobody's going to claim that we were robbed because we've only had two corners tonight and neither of them were... Oh, look. I mean, now now Noy is on the floor. Absolute bollocks. Nah, he's just stretching. So am I, bro. My heart's broken, bro. Like, seriously. Uh... Uh, stop the play. There are two balls on the field. For heaven's sake. This is sake. all bullshit, guys. And again, I'll tell you the great. He'll, he'll have money again in the summer to go and fuck us more. And go and f Who's he bringing in from Chelsea this year? I don't know. Like, I don't know. He liked Havertz. He's done Willian. Uh, he he wanted Mason be... Mount. Oh, fuck me. Bring... He bought Jorginho as well. Jorginho. Willian. Havertz. Wanted fucking Petr Mason Czech, Mount. David Luiz. No, no, no. That, I'm talking just Arteta himself. I know Arsenal historically like doing business with Chelsea for shit players. What I'm saying is is who is... I think Sterling might be available. I reckon it could be Sterling. What, 350 grand? 370 grand a week? Yeah. The new highest paid player coming from Chelsea? Yeah. I'll tell Yeah, I think he'll do it. And he'll justify it to all the fucking super fans and Twitter fuckers. And he's English. And he's English. Oh, yeah. It ticks the English box. Well done, um, WB. It ticks the English box. Yeah, but the problem is with the English tax, it might cost a bit more, and we're into four minutes of stoppage time. Yeah, don't worry. We spent 65 on Havertz, man. Don't worry. We'll figure it. And 100, 100 million on Declan Rice. Trossard, beautiful stuff. And Katia just keeping things ticking. If we score a goal, Bayern's heads are going to drop. Yeah, and we've got like fucking one at the back on. And offside puts paid to all of that. That could have been so beautiful. We had players coming in, a huge melee in the penalty area, but uh, no one was able to get any end of that. And Kai Havertz on his return to Germany. I bet he wishes he were at Leverkusen now. 
celebrating a Bundesliga title with Mr. Shaka. Wind your neck in, you prat. <laughs> I love it, man, man. Oh, four hundred minutes. All right, great. Where I'm standing, one has already been played. A tired pass from Harry Kane. Havertz is on his way, and that should be a free kick and another booking, maybe. Yep. This time, Kimmich should be going into the book for that, and he is. So, listen, two and a half minutes. We get a goal. It goes to extra time. Watch the German heads drop. How, how is that not a penalty? What's not a penalty? The foul on whoever fell down on the floor. <laughs> Cover, have it have have it. You'll be given a have fucking it. pay rise, bruv. The players we don't want at the club, bruv, will be given a pay rise. <laughs> And for some reason, we see Kane barking at the referee. There's a foul on. It looks like Kimmich has been set to uh, tumbling. Yep, uh, Trossard sending Kimmich to the floor. The Belgian clearly not uh, having the best time of it. Halfway through the stoppages. Let me take a look and see. We're also into four minutes at the um, empty had. Two minutes of almost. Oh, my God. There. Ref, come on. Didn't Joshua Kimmich win the World Cup for Germany? Yes, bros. Fuck Arteta, man, seriously. Like, do you know what? What, going to give him another 200 mil in the summer to what? Buy what? Who else from Chelsea? Again, what, Sterling could he buy from Chelsea? Like, I'd... fuck me. He'll fuck the summer and fuck us again. Yep, he's not going to get a striker. He'll still stick with Havertz. Uh, Lee, no. no, not really, mate. I expected nothing less apart from an Arsenal defeat tonight, I have to admit. From the first leg, like, you know what I mean? We, we had to take control. No fans, whether that means anything or not. Bollocks to it. Oh, mate. Only Arteta's Arsenal, innit? Jesus got a yellow card for dropping the ball. Persistently loving Havertz. Like, fuck you, bros. Bring him off. I know you did, bros. You said 3-1. Like, shouts out to all, all the real ones. Please be getting the likes on the video. Do be subscribing oh. if we is new. 20 seconds to go. Reyes halfway up the field and having to run back. Still shout 15 out to seconds John to Arby. go. Might get a last chance. Might not. We'll see. Benny Blanco. Odegaard. Blanco. Charge of room midfield. And Benny keeps it in play. Very Gets true, bros. Saka. Beautiful stuff. But Min Jae Kim sends him tumbling, and that will be a free kick. Arsenal's last chance. A quickly taken free kick, but Ben White unable to get on the end of that. There will be an Arsenal corner, possibly our last chance of the game. Bros, if we had played Saka. Lille, who Aston Villa are playing, they would have beat us. Do you know what I mean? It's just an Arteta thing, bros. At least Arteta will say on this occasion it was a world-class team historically that beat us, not fucking Valencia or fucking Olympic or whoever else has fucked us out of the European competition. Saka with the before. corner, left footed in swing, a dab it rise in the penalty area, but that is headed away, and the referee has blown his whistle, and it is all over, bar the shouting. And at the empty hat, we've just passed the four minutes of stoppage yeah, time. As, as it's over, fuck these guys, fuck off. Oh my god, that's so hard. My fucking microphone's in the way. I can't lick the fucking Rizla. Here you go. Manchester City corner. This could be the last chance of their game. If they They'll score from here, one. it's They'll all score. over. They'll score. They'll score. Watch. They'll score. We got Ruben Diaz. Well, that was 2001. So, guys, the inevitable happened. The disastrous Bayern Munich. They could still be in a shout of winning a trophy with Harry Kane this season. They the go out with the corner cup. and Holland heads it over the bar, and that should be extra time. Yep, the referee's blown his whistle, it will be extra time. Okay, so I am going to check the uh, lineups and see who has been who started and who substituted. 
I'm fucking distraught. Guys, do get the likes on the video. Let's just jump over to a decent team. Uh, it was, in fact, De Bruyne who equalised on the 76th minute after Rodrigo put them ahead. I've just I'm put sure the Arteta out it. picture on uh, Twitter, guys. Right. Danny AFC TV Twitter. Go get a like on it. It's been up for eight seconds and Jay, whoever he is, has already responded to it. <laughs> He's okay. already responded to it. I just know that my good friend Northside will be fuming I'm at the moment. Guys. But let's watch a decent All team right. now, Man City. Let's watch a decent team. Okay. And, um... So they started with uh, Guardiola at left back, Ruben Diaz and Akanji in the middle, Walker on the right, Rodri playing a defensive midfield pivot, Phil Foden, Kevin De Bruyne in the middle, Bernardo Silva in the middle, Fucking Grealish on the left, and Haaland. Uh, the only substitute they made was Doku coming on in the 72nd minute for Grealish before De Bruyne scored. As far as Madrid are concerned, Furlon Mendy at left back, Danny Carvajal at right back, Rudiger and Nacho in the middle, Camavinga and Tony Cruz as the uh, defensive midfield pivots, Valverde, Bellingham and Rodrigo as the midfield three with Vinicius Jr. Jaha, I love Luton you, man. Please get a big like. Sorry, Manny, on the video. Um, respect for jumping in. And, um, yeah. And uh, two substitutions made. Luka Modric coming on for Tony Cruz after the goal was scored. And then Brahim Diaz race, replacing the goal scorer, Rodrigo. So uh, this is it. Extra time. This oh, is quality don't European we just football. Love Arteta, guys. Like, ain't he just the fucking best hero? The hero of all men. Oh, I can't wait to see what he does in the summer to fuck us over. Bastard. We'll buy another goalkeeper. Yeah. Well, he's gonna have to I've, 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 I've got a Twitter you. group chat right now where, where some bloke has said the difference between Arsenal and the top teams, including Bayern, is that Arsenal needs 15 chances to score a goal. The top teams need just one. Yeah. It's because our strikers are shit. Yep. They are feces, fecal matter, human waste, human That's... excrement. Bastards. Guys, let's let's be loving that tweet on Twitter anyway. Fuck, please, why more goals than Arsenal? And it looks as though Haaland has been subbed off. We're going to see who's replaced him. Alvarez. I'm watching Alvarez right now. Off, so. Yep, you boys have called it. Julian Alvarez, World Cup winner. By the way, Manny. Yep. It's not a dig or anything at you. I'm just saying, um, as I always said, it would be, what, 89th or never. Thomas Party didn't come on at all. Like, please. No, he like, didn't. No, yeah. he didn't. No, he didn't. And, I'm not uh, saying he would have saved be... the game, Manny. I'm not saying he would have saved the game. But there's a certain time in a game. Jorginho's about 49. His legs are gone in the 17th minute. Like, fuck about, mate. When Arteta makes something personal or he decides he doesn't want to play a footballer, bruv, all I'm saying is love or hate Wenger because Lee Akers is a geezer that just hated Wenger. And I'll, I'll always row with him over it. Wenger wouldn't have made it personal. He wouldn't have devalued a footballer. He wouldn't have tried to just say, like, you're a Gwen Doozy. I don't care if we get five pence for you. I just don't like you. Aubameyang the same. Do you know what I mean? Captain. Annoys me more of Aubameyang. He's the prick that gave Aubameyang the 300 and fucking blood clout 50 grand a week. But at least uh, with Aubameyang, we got an FA Cup out of it. What have we gotten with Odegaard so far? Oh, Dan, I'm watching the cause advert. <laughs> Is it just me, or, one of, or does one of the Manchester City assistant coaches look almost exactly like Kevin Keegan? I don't know at the moment. I don't care, because obviously, remember, I'm a minute behind you. So I'm on an advert. Like, yeah, I'm watching advert. <laughs> yeah, so same as... <laughs> Yeah. Well, at the moment, City are about to kick us off. I do believe that is Phil Foden with the ball. Phil, oh, Fury, Fury, you sick. Fury, you sick. Okay. And uh, attacking from uh, right to left are the Citizens. And they're underway. Pass back to Rodri. Oh, now we're back in the football. There you go. The Kanji. Unai. Unai got Diaz. further in the Champions League with Villarreal than Arteta ever will. And who do yep. you have at Villarreal? Per Torres or something? Was he, did he play for Villarreal? 
Yeah, anyway, he yeah. did. That's right. Oh, Pau yeah. Torres. He had Pau Torres. Also, he had, he had Coquelin and uh, quite a few others. That little young kid, is it Ye uh, Jeremy? Oh, not Jeremy. Pino. P oh, fuck. I yeah, Pino. And also, there you go, who hey. else was in that team? Raul Albiol, this, another Spanish pensioner. There you go. And we're stuck with Arteta. Well, I'll just take Haaland off. We're struggling. Is that a struggle this season? And, uh, ooh, there's a player on the floor. Yeah, yeah, uh, Manny, 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 Manny. Me and you know personally he's had a struggle this season. But again, there is a, there's not an Arsenal player even close to have scored the 18-19 league goals he scored this season. So there's a I struggle know. and there's just... Pep is a perfectionist. And Pep wouldn't have allowed us to run into this season. For the second season in a row, bearing in mind we've bottled the league, he wouldn't have just left it with Jesus and Nketiah up front and by Havertz. Of course not. He sold Jesus, remember? And Zinchenko. Exactly. And the season, and the season, and immediately after, you know, he sold them to us, they won the treble. It was Bellingham who's on the floor. I don't a Birmingham know. boy playing in Manchester. Lovely. Yeah. You know, before Zidane wore the number five, the number five at Madrid was all, almost always worn by a defender, Manuel Sanchez being one of them. Yeah, but if I'm not wrong, I think it was retired until Jude come along, no? No, it wasn't retired. I think a lot of other people have worn the five jersey. Well, I can since even... Zidane? Since Zidane? Yes, um, I, I, I do believe that they have used the five jersey. I will um, re research that and get back to you. Please do, because I'm pretty sure... Even though I'm not a Real Madrid fan, I've never noticed any motherfucker running around in the number five shirt. I don't know. I'm not a Real Madrid fan. Maybe that's a bit of a weird thing for me to say. I don't know. It's just not coming to mind, Manny. Anyway, some great work by Bernardo Silva to get that, keep that ball from going out of play. And there's Bernardo Silva. Let me Silva ask Google what it Madrid. is. Hold on. How if you go to Real Madrid, if one, you... shut. Oh, sorry, but sorry, Manny. Not I don't mean it. Like, sorry, because you talk. You're in my ear. Sorry. Hold on. I just want to ask. Oh, sorry. Hold on. Has any player wore the number five shirt at Real Madrid since Zinedine Zidane? You can easily find that out. Go to Real Madrid seasons, look at the squad lists, and you'll find them. Hold on, Manny, my man. Doku against Carvajal. Doku unable to get through. Passing it out to Guardiol. Rodri. I think that's uh, Walker. Yep, he's got the captain's armband. Um, from what I'm reading, Manny, but I'm not going to say it's conclusive. I think I'm right. Oh, hold I on, will, maybe I'm wrong. Hold on, maybe I'm wrong. I will prove you wrong, my dear friend. Okay, yeah, I think yeah, I think I'm wrong. Hold on. What do you mean, save and exit? Just fuck off, you. Cunt. Um. Yeah, Rafael Varane did. All right, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> fuck off. I, I told love you, you, Manny. I told I love you. you. It's a defender. I told you. All right, sweet. No, do you see the, do you, have you ever watched Blue Peter, Manny? I'm sure you have. Your Blue Peter of course. Manny, you <laughs> see your Blue <laughs> It's going through the uh, fucking skies now. Woo! Oh, it's an aeroplane. Of course, of course, of course. Your Blue Peter say, And let me say, Carol Keating, Lord rest your soul. We miss you and love you. John Leslie, loved you, you tall Scottish um, so-and-so. I hope you're doing all right now. <laughs> I don't remember nothing from Blue Peter apart from the dog. I do seem to remember Gary Mabbott coming on Blue Peter once and telling people how to inject um, insulin into your body by um, using an orange as a, you know, a sort of a prop. It was a demonstration. Doku into the penalty area, but uh, Mendy is able to force that behind for a corner, not taking any chances. And here's the thing now, if I were Kepa as a Balaga, I was think I'd be thinking, why did I sign for Madrid? And if I were Ancelotti, I'd be thinking, why did I sign Kepa? And listen, why is Arda Galea nowhere near the Real Madrid first team? And he'll leave. I hear Borussia much and Gladbach, AC Milan, Borussia Dortmund want him. 
And, Gule and should Gehea be coming on as a substitute for games like this. I mean, he has proven his worth in La Liga. I don't know why he's not being used in the Champions Plus, he's League. He's a brilliant footballer. He's a fucking unbelievable footballer. I'm just getting a drink, boys. He's an unbelievable you do not, footballer. You don't need to convince me. I've seen, I've seen him play. I've seen him play. I've, I've seen him play. And so far, City are dominating. I don't think Madrid are going to want to try to shut up shop, but they've got to prevent uh, City from scoring a goal. Vardy, hold on, boys. Alvarez. Oh, I just see Foden. Hey, okay, it's still not got a club. Yeah, I know um, 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 Acres. I was a bit shocked as well. And, uh, I hope that ain't. I hope he ain't. I hope he ain't. I hope he ain't going to the other side. I'm sure he isn't. Juma is a very loyal guy, but you don't need to look like fuck me. Like it's like me closing down the channel yeah, tonight. Really right, know. right, Manny. Fuck you. You're a drinks like WB says. WB, I don't like you because you got a beard. I'm closing down the channel because Arsenal lost. Fuck you. Like that's. I, I can't believe Juma left the group. I think you guys know what I mean. Like, yeah. Like, what is it? I know it's on. He did. He, he said, like, since 2 3, 2, 2, 3, 2 4, it's been the same fucking just bollocks and bullshit. But I know. I know, Lee. It stings Take me as well. Arsenal, Take a look what Arsenal have put on their Instagram a Champions League journey to be proud of. Fuck you. Don't say it to me. Say it to the. Uh, I'm, I'm say saying it to the, it the Instagram bastards. He's sending it right to your face with your jinx. No, I fuck off, WB. I love you, bros, but fuck off. <laughs> I'm so in no, boys, I'm I'm just in no, I'm in zero mood, innit? I just can't believe it. I can't believe I haven't agreed to watch Man City fucking win or carry, go go through to the semi finals. Only so I love Manny. He's like, yeah, you staying on down at the area. I wish I did it now because I just feel to punch the wall or something. <laughs> no, Co, you're lucky I don't beat animals. I'll kick you. I'm joking, Doug. Do you know what I mean? Let me go wake Chloe up. One second. Look, WB's going to be evil. Like, for no reason at all, Arsenal have lost and we go and wake up my birth. <laughs> yep. Yep, literally. The club is perfectly acres. Manny, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm almost done. I'm not going to close out just now. We'll probably see it through to the first half. Let's see how I feel at half time of extra time. I'm just so fucking... Oh, yeah, it's Manny. your call. It's your call. Don't worry. Brother, about it, how typical, bruvs? That like, how fucking typical? Yeah, we can't be proud of this journey. We stumbled through against Porto, and we yep. couldn't even force the issue against uh, what, according to people, was a poor Bayern Munich team. Exactly. They, uh, oh, and City very nearly had a chance there, but Foden fluff is lying. And if, when Man City do go through tonight, yeah. Watch what the fuck they're going to do to Bayern Munich over two legs, bruv. Yeah, it's going to be fucking punishment and fucking torture and pain, okay? Oh, I've, mate, I've seen what they did to Bayern Munich in, a, in earlier, earlier rounds. I know what they're capable of. Okay, so this is what I'm saying. Watch the... Tw it won't even be fucking close when fucking uh, Man City fuck over fucking Bayern Munich. It's not even going to be close. Like, there'll be no fucking contest, bruv. Yeah, this is the tie that uh, has now proven itself in many ways to be worthy of a final. I mean... Um, you got two heavyweights punching at each other, and it's a uh, uh, beautiful. Uh, John Arby's beautiful just sent me a quote. Scene. I don't know. Obviously, I, I don't know when Wenger said this. Apparently, but uh, John Arby's just sent me something. But I like it. Arsene Wenger says, "If you can't keep winning in the last part of the season, you'll never win anything." Sounds kind of fucking accurate to me. You I'm bet your bovril. It sounds accurate. This time, Bernardo Silva doesn't keep it in play. And we've got five minutes left of the first half. And it uh, looks as though Real Madrid are bringing on someone. I'll find out who that is for you. So it was Modric and Brahim Diaz who came on as substitutes. Modric replacing Cruz and Diaz replacing Rodrigo. But um, so far, City have uh, pair, pair, end Madrid back in their own half. And uh, Lunin under some pressure, but eventually gets it out to Rudiger. I'm just glad for Madrid's sake that Shuamani isn't playing in the defence. 
Modric sending it forward. And, oh, this is promising. Vinicius Jr. up against Kyle Walker, but Walker showing his experience and pretty much uh, blocking Vinicius from going further. Just a pity that the poor bloke got injured when England played Brazil and Ezri Konza had to deal with the guy. And just think, if Ben White hadn't have been such an immature brat, that would have been him coming on at Wembley. <laughs> I don't think Ben White gives a fuck, bros. Well, you know what? England shouldn't give a fuck about him. England won't miss him. They've got um, Ezri Kons has proven that he's a more than capable deputy. And in fact, on Sunday, he proved that he is everything as a defender that Ben White will never be. And, bros, hold on. I'm not bigging up Ben White or anything. I'm just saying, personally, remember, I'm not very patriotic. We've had this discussion before. I'm just saying, like, if I was blessed to have been good enough to be a footballer, I don't know if I'd be for England either. To be honest, that is Vinicius Junior's last involvement. He might be carrying an injury. I'm not too sure. His uh, fellow Brazilian trying to pick him up off the floor, Edison. And uh, let me see who the uh, Madrid number 17 is. Lucas Vasquez. A decent player. I was going to say it should be Arda Galea, but uh, Lucas Vasquez is a very good fucking footballer. Galea right. is in the squad. He is on the bench. Maybe he'll be brought on in the second half of extra time. I don't know. And uh, Vinicius looking very disoriented and Ancelotti bringing him off at something like you, the right time. Look at your stats for this season. Who? Arda Galea. Bows, yeah, go on. Interestingly, go on. Order. Good call and by Ancelotti. Yeah. Some fresh legs and maybe some fresh impetus. Phil Foden with the corner, left footed away swinger. Headed away, but uh, it is with De Bruyne. Daniel Orsato, not. Uh, just allowing the play to go, uh, go through. Alvarez, Done. De Bruyne whipping it in. Yes. Punched away by Lunin, but only as far as Doku outside the penalty area. Doku now Done, looking very impressive on coming games. on. Oh, hold on. But, I reckon he's only played f between three and five games, but go on. Okay, how many, how many well goals? There to Valverde, but he controlled that well Possibly enough. none, Stephen. He's hardly played any goals. Uh, hold on, I'm going to say one. Uh, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. Uh, fuck, no, is that yield is? Stephen, fuck off and just give me the stats. Sorry, mate. Five games, one goal. In La Liga. Okay, cool. Sweet. Oh, yeah. That, that goal was against uh, Rafa Benitez of Celta Vigo, and that fat uh, bugger got fired the next day. Anyway, Stephen, he's not been given a chance. He's a fucking incredible talent. Just trust me, okay? Hang on. I, there remember, is I was with you with Green. Look, Antonio yeah, still yeah. going to be at Real Madrid, right? There is a part of me that thinks that Guler will get more chances next season. Great play there from uh, Brahim Diaz, keeping the ball in play. Vasquez to Camavinga in the middle. That's why Yui and, loves uh, me, by the way. That's why Yui, I was like, he was like, bro, you knew, I, I'm fucking Turkish. You knew, you knew about Arda Guler before me. I oh, mean, I'm Turkish. I watch Turkish football. I'd never heard of Arda Guler until I come on your stream one day. And you were like, Arsenal should sign Arda Guler. He was like, who the fuck is that? There you go. That's why I done that movement in Wood Green to them Turkish geezers, bro. Remember the Fenerbahce fucking shirt? Yeah. And yeah, the ironic. Shot. Hold on, Here's bro. The ironic... Hold on, no, sorry, Manny. The guy didn't know about yeah. Arda Gilev, and I was like, no, Arda Gilev. And he was like, oh, yes, very good. Like, but I don't really know him, bros. I done it in Wood Green. Like, I was like, yeah. I should have recorded He's a good now. player. Uh, and you, and you, and listen, player, you, proved, you proved to be right about Mudrak, but he is still finding his feet. And I think um, after a year or two, he will mature into a fine footballer. Um, De Bruyne, I believe that's uh, Silver, yeah. Walker coming in. And again, bros, whether it's Sesedo, and I'm not calling him out at Chelsea, and I'm sure he will turn it around at Chelsea. Bros, Chelsea's just that kind of club, isn't it? I actually don't blame Arda Galea. Uh Sorry, fuck me. Mikhailo Mudrak for what's going on. Bros, Fernando Torres was one of the most lethal fucking strikers for Liverpool at a certain point over one or two seasons. That I'd seen in a minute. Do you know what I mean? And he went to Chelsea and just gone. Gone. All oh, right. Do so, you turn into um, a shite footballer overnight, bro? No, you don't. Absolutely not. So what happened to Fernando Torres then? Like, I'm just being real. Got old. I don't know. And he I isn't the only that... high profile striker to come. 
I can tell you that there are two minutes of added time uh, given at the um, at the end of the first half. Bros, forget Man United. Jean Arby, forget Man United. If fucking Emery finishes fourth and wins the Conference Bastard Europa Bastard Conference Fuck You League, he has had a better season than Arsenal on the budget that he's got. Okay. Fuck me. Raheem Diaz, what a fine player he is. Vasquez and Bellingham on the right. It's Bellingham who gets it, and Bellingham wins the corner. So, could Real Madrid nick a goal? We're going to see. Come on, man. Is that the DS that comes from Blackburn? Or Man City? What? Uh, no, no, no. Not, no, there's one at Madrid as well. Um, Hold on. Sorry, my phone's giving Where did he me fucking... from? How does Ancelotti do it? Have the appetite to continue managing at this level? Because you know what it is, bros. Look at him at Everton. Like, a lot, hold up. No, it's not even that, Stephen. Look at him. When a lot of clubs didn't seem to be fucking with him, he went to Everton. And Everton is, again, it's like it's almost a jinx club. Like, like the Lord himself could come down on earth and fucking struggle at Everton. Because, I, you know what I mean? It's like since Ferguson quit Man United, or if you want to ask me the frank truth, since Ferguson uh, Ooh, got railroaded out of Arsenal, there, Very nearly putting Real Madrid Both of these ahead. clubs, for me, I don't have know if he's offside, but that would have been a fine, fine goal. Um, City's defence at sixes and sevens. Wonderful pass in. Akanji left for dead. All Rudiger had to do was, uh, you know, try and aim it for the top corner. Edison would have been beaten, but he just couldn't get a proper left foot on that. And that is that the, the chance is still time. bugging me. Yeah, I know, bro. Seriously, it's haunting me a little piece as well. I can't lie. Anywhere but straight would have gone in. If it goes to penalties, I might fancy Real Madrid. Haaland's off. I don't know if they've got good penalty takers. Foden, De Bruyne, Rodri, Stone. Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> is De Bruyne still on? Oh, yeah, there he is. Yeah, yeah, right, sweet. I was going to say, is De Bruyne still on? But yeah, fair enough. I've got uh, some cheeky bugger over here who happens to be um, uh, whose channel I'm also co-host of saying, Arteta, bottled Villarreal top four title race my manager, you cheeky little... I, I'm going to have words with him Bastard. for that. My manager. I like it. How did he miss that chance from two yards? Really uh, Arsenal have hurt my feelings, guys. Seriously, I'm I'm into my I'm right in my feelings right now. I'm fucking in my feelings, boys. Oh, mate, I'm broken hearted. But anyway, at the end of the day. Did we actually expect anything fucking less? Isn't this Not just really. a norm? We expected, more. we expected more from that than anything less. Hello, well, Madrid, I'm putting. I'm putting hello, at... Madrid. It looks as though you're staying for the end of um, extra time and it could go to penalties. Hold on. Hold on. I've just got to put something on TikTok. Just be like, yeah, I'm putting a Real Madrid song. I'm putting a picture of Arteta out and then like Viva Madrid is going to be the song that's played. Just because I can, Manny. Yep. There you go. There you go. Have a piece of that, you fucking, fucking TikTok cunts. De Bruyne winning a throw off Camavinga. Short throw to Foden. Foden against Modric. And uh, Foden unable to really make, make much of that. Modric should be able to. I need a fight tonight. Shouts out to you, Lee. Uh, Brendan Rodgers won the trophy more recently than Arteta in English football. Brendan Rodgers and, and uh, Arteta are quite similar. They're very, yep. they're very bottle job. They're like, they're like, they're very, 
Yeah. No, but here's the thing. Here's the thing. I mean, Rogers is now, of course, winning titles with Celtic. But again, you know, I'm Listen, pretty Manny, certain that any Danny team... could win titles with Celtic. <laughs> I was I... going to say that you didn't have to uh, have to pipe pipe in. I knew. Good, I knew. It's actually like, I don't, it's not the maddest achievement. Like someone only come in whenever the fuck in December. He was nine points like behind them. I'm just saying it's a two horse race, and like just Scotland is a shit league. Like. Yeah. Didn't set, didn't Rangers get like relegated to like three leagues down and still won every league on the way up? Well, they well, did. Yeah, they really did. Again, they, yeah, that's good. Well, they're a bigger club, but I imagine. So hold on, the team they're playing, which must have been a bit weird for some of their players, even though they lost any of their good players, is like they're. At, Bowden. Trade for Q. You've got one hundred and twenty-two people. Congratulations. Please say hello. Like it was, it was like it was worse than non-league football. It was uh, I don't know. Hackney Marshes. And yet to climb through that, even though when these people that only got 100 people in their stadium, yeah, 100 people, most of them are just fucking, I don't know, ambulance and police and whatever, yeah, and a man and his dog. Then they'll come to Ibrox, and Ibrox are still getting like 10, 20,000 people, even though, like, yeah, it was just, yeah. Decent supporters, shit club. <laughs> I don't even want to watch the football anymore. I know, bros. I feel exactly the same. I'm thinking, Ooh, why do I Doku, amazing run, amazing run, amazing stuff from Doku. But once again, the defense outstanding. Vasquez clearing that up. And this time, Camavinga. I'll go and have another try and run. The rest of fucking watch this shit. Like, me and Kyle can rest on Thursday. We're better, better than this fucking shit. More excitement, yeah. Fucking hell. Literally, I saw more nurses than I saw fucking portraits in the net. I bet WB is a cheater, but I bet, but WB, I bet w... Darling, could you touch me here? I can't feel myself. <laughs> <laughs> could you hold me for a second? I feel nervous. <laughs> Just hold my middle leg. <laughs> yeah. What's your middle leg? Just hold me between my fucking leg. You... <laughs> Before I die! <laughs> You'll have it on Squeeze your conscience. <laughs> Give me the kiss of life. <laughs> oh, and we're back. Oh, um. oh Man Z. Go on, Doku. Oh, Doku can't do do. What's happened to their life? Yeah, another Real Madrid player on the floor. Looks as though it's Carver, hell. Danny throws again. Ten more, minute, ten more minutes and it's penalties. Danny throws. Yeah. He'll be back. Ciao. I bet his laptop died. Yeah, listen, um, how is it that Welsh teams can play in the Premier League but not Scottish? Um, I think with Cardiff City and Swansea, they've been in the um, English League for a long time before the Welsh League was formed, so... They ended up um, being um, allowed. Danny, yep, he's back, not frozen. And uh, Edda Militao coming on for. You Danny know, wait, Carver so House. basically, whoa, whoa, whoa. Manny, what I should do is rather than jump in and jump out like I do, I've got to wait. Obviously, you guys waited. That's why you were back quicker than me, yeah? No, we yeah, didn't go nowhere. We haven't That's what I'm yeah, saying. I jumped anywhere. in, jumped out. Okay. Edda Militao. Is that Carver How? What does that Who's mean? That Juma has left the group. Then Danny. Yeah, Edda Militao uh, on for Danny Carvajal. Carvajal probably nursing an injury. So um... have you left the group then? I haven't left the fuck. How am I going to leave my own group? You fuckwit. I don't know. Just clearly, what he means. Well, I fucking haven't. 
And Millisau's first touch is to send it uh, forward, but... Uh, anyway, boys, 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 I'm going to ask you a quick there. question. Fuck Millisau on Go. Oliver. Manny. Manny. Yeah. If you was the glorious man himself with a wonderful hairstyle, Mikhail the fuckhead Arteta. Um, after one bottle job in a league title race, after two bottle jobs and a fuck you against Bayern Munich, we know he ain't going nowhere. He'll probably be rewarded of a 17-year rolling contract. Um... What sort of signings would you be after, my friend? And I ask this to both of you, of course. Get rid what of Ramsdale. Decisions Ramsdale. on players. Uh, sorry, players. Get rid, of, get rid of Ramsdale. Put him on the bench. Um, I mean, Ramsdale, sell him for whatever you can get. Put Ray on the bench. Bring another goalkeeper in. Um, I know that a lot of people have been talking about the Georgian bloke, Mahmoud Ashfali. He might be a quality. He'll be playing in the Euros as well. Um Definitely need a striker. I don't care about Tony's attitude. And um, this just... Bro, no, no, stones. no, no, no. It's Isaac or no one for me, bro. It's bollocks. Isaac is good, but he gets injured far too often. Do bro, you really want I to have know. another injured player? Bro, I don't, yeah, but I can't... Bro, I don't want any other... I don't want Gorkarez. Gorkarez is at Coventry fucking 18 months ago. I'm friend. not what mentioning Gorkarez. I don't... I'm, I'm not what? mentioning Gorkarez. I'm talking about Tony. Osserman's a no-go. All right, Tony, what what, what has he done? hold on. So he's come back. Yeah. What's he got? Three goals since he come back. Yeah. He's got three goals this season. Four. And that's the thing. Listen, my, you know my mate Steve Jenkins, right, Mr. B? Well, yeah. he apparently has a theory that the reason why Brentford slapped that 100 million price tag on him is just so that, um, you know, clubs might not be. Did you see Brentford the other day? Him. Why was Ivan Tony on the bench, Manny? Sorry. Oh, maybe a tip with the manager. I don't know. He came on and was having a bit of a Barney with Nathan Collins afterwards. Yep. I think yep. The hold on, hold on. The how about, how about like Danny AFC TV always said, sorry to say, whether you bet against, on the strength that you bet against. Well, the boy has been taken off. He is a shit cunt. Manny? Uh-huh. John Stones is on. Manny? John Stones and Kovacic are on. Manny? Huh? Yeah. There is no way on Lord or Allah's earth tonight, sorry, I'm not being blasphemous at all, that Ivan Tony would have made the difference. So take Havertz away, bro. Yeah? Who we both don't like, yeah? But I'm going to be real with you. Havertz is every bit as a decent footballer as fucking Ivan Tony. Ivan Tony, yes. Yeah. He'll do well in aerial challenges, muscling people on the ball. But we tried that with Giroud. We don't play football like that, Manny, I'm afraid to say. Um, Giroud was just a hold-up, man. Well, again, what the fuck would Tony be at Arsenal? Because he ain't that skillful. When fucking Martinelli or Odegaard put that perfect through ball through, he isn't that nippy. Ad Bros, no disrespect to him, yeah? He's not that fucking good, all right? I'm going to disagree. I mean, I have seen him put on some bursts of um, speed before. And look, um, when you said that he's a lot more muscular than Havertz, I mean, that's pretty much half the battle for me. I mean, okay, how does it let, Let's just say you've got a target man, yeah? And yeah. you see him not being quite able to really move, muscle his way past. Uh -huh. The reason why um, Gabriel Martinelli is still perpetually on the wings and not in the centre is because, according to a lot of people, he doesn't quite have the strength to be able to, you know, really bulldoze his way through defences. But um, okay. is Havertz any better? So at least with Tony, you know, when you have someone that strong and that um, powerful, it's pretty much half the battle. And he can actually end up, you know, giving you more chances of a so goal So do you otherwise. believe, hold on, let alone no one else in the world, like the Pep Guardiola's or Klopp's, but that's obviously been a bit bitchy. But obviously he ain't going to ever be signed by Real Madrid, Liverpool, Man City, elite clubs, yeah? So take that aside, because I can guarantee you this. At 28 years old, you know what I mean? Betting against your own clubs, I promise you, as the Lord is watching me, bro. He's not going to sign for an elite football club. Yeah? Pr I promise you. I'd close well, down the I channel mean, quicker. So what I'm well, saying is, I mean, hold on. I mean, hold I on. mean he, si he signed for Newcastle, who were an elite club at the beginning of the season, technically. But uh, uh, Was they an elite club at the time? Finale. Was they an elite club at the time? Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, maybe there not. we go. There we go. That's what I'm saying. Do you know what I mean? But they I were mean, struggling. Mike I mean, actually took over and they fucked I up. I mean, they're, they're, they're iconic, but not quite elite. Uh, exactly. Do you know what I mean? If you asked, um, I don't know, let me think. I remember when Marcel Desailly, yeah? You remember it? Well, I know you remember him. Yeah. Do you remember when he signed for Chelsea? Legend. Legend. Oh, do you remember when he signed for him. Chelsea? Do you know what he actually said? What did he say? 
um, I had to look on the map. I didn't know who Chelsea was. Like all I knew about England was Arsenal, Man United, Liverpool. Do you know what I mean? I'd never yep. heard of Chelsea. He goes, but yeah, I see the money they was offering me. Simple as. Fuck that. I went. Well, I mean, you know, the man's a legend. Okay, exactly. And even a legend thought, fuck it, I'll go for it. Uh, who's Chelsea? I've never even heard of the cunts. That surprised me, that comment, to be honest with you. But you still went Real Madrid clearly trying to shut up shop, but also trying to get something on the counter. And they could now. Bellingham receiving that pass from Brahim Diaz. Uh, attempted pass for Vasquez, but that is easily cut off. But will that won't be kept in play. And I think Osato was awarded a free kick. Or has now, Harry Kane, for instance, yeah. I'm not saying again, like his age isn't perfect. But when he left to go by Munich at the end of the season, yeah, and we've seen it by Munich, even though they're shit, he's been immaculate up front. I don't know if any of you caught the the, the gossip column, not the gossip. Uh, he had a, basically it was an interview. Was it Times Express, your girl, your dad, whatever? And he was basically it's, it's always personal <laughs> against Arsenal. Did you catch this, yep. Manny? Yep. It's always personal against Arsenal. And he basically said, "Was it because I was confused? Was it nine or when it was it when he was fourteen? When I got released by the club because it, it was inflicting in two different papers, but or maybe I just looked too closely. But yeah, being released by Arsenal, um, it always makes this shit personal. Yeah, okay, so we released him. What I'm saying is though, perfect age or not, trying to negotiate with Daniel Levy and Tottenham or not, we had just flopped a title. Harry came." Has had attention before. The Bayern Munich fucking thing surprised me. If we had a bit of bottle, we could have went for Harry Kane right now. And I do believe with his usual between 25 and 30 Premier League goals per season, we would actually be top by now. Because we're only a couple of points behind. So if us top scorers has got seven goals this season, yeah? I think add that with another 23. 23 goals more than what we got this season? I believe top of the league. Would we have had the bottle to sign Harry Kane? Would Harry well, I don't know. Kane Why is little bitch bitching us? about it's always personal? Oh. Arsenal? Yeah. John Stones. Camavinga with a brilliant tackle there. Real Madrid defending superbly, but also very strong on the counter. It's two against two. Brahim Diaz. Kovacic coming back to defend, but uh, the cavalry is coming in. It's Camavinga to Bellingham. I believe that is Diaz. Vasquez is in the area. And, uh, well, Osato saying enough of the nonsense. That's the goal kick. And it looks as though we are headed to the dreaded penalty shootout. Modric done so much just to get the ball back and then decided to kick the ball out. He was trying to cross it, but he overhit it, the poor bloke. He kicked it and fell over. I think if Modric went to like Man City. Okay, not offside, but uh, Alvarez can only shoot straight into Lunin. Any time added on? Is Vinicius Junior to... injured? What? Is Vinicius Junior injured? Well, he was taken off. I think he must have felt something. We've got one minute of stoppage time, and uh, this could be the last chance for either team to score. Did I fuck off again? I done nothing. Yo. Yo, you're back. Yep, we're going to hear you. We're going to hear you loud and clear. Hold on, what's this here? So, John Arby's just sent me official Arsenal are out of the club's World Cup, World Cup after tonight. Uh, source, but uh, hold on. Hold on, let me just see what you said. Yeah, bro. If we had won tonight, we would have qualified for the competition. Okay, the Club World Cup. I think what Man City won during the season there. Official Arsenal are out of the club's World Cup after tonight. 
uh, RB Salzburg, access to the World Cup instead of Arsenal. Man City, Chelsea, Real Madrid, Atletico Madrid, Bayern Munich, Borussia Dortmund, Paris Saint-Germain, Inter, Juventus, Benfica, Porto, Salzburg will all play in the club's World Cup or have access to it or try and qualify for it, whatever. Uh, I don't know all the rules and everything on that, etc. But yeah, it just shows. How that. is Atletico qualified? They're in the like fifth or sixth in the league and they're out of Champions League. How are they qualified? Yeah. I was in the Champions League last season. I don't know. If you want to, if you want to, um, they've won, Simeone's won the league. I'm just saying, if you want to measure them over the last five years to Arsenal's Arteta, like it's not even close. It's night and day. And we go to penalties, boys. All right. So why is my TV still trying to fuck with me? Edison against Lunin. What minute are you in, Manny? Because no point me what like not watching. I'm he, saying he, like, he's full he's... time. He's full time. Yeah, full time. We're going to penalties. All right, I I'm see. ten seconds away. Shouts out to you, Jean Arby. This shall be interesting, guys. Shouts out to all the real ones. Do be liking. Do be subscribing. Shouts out to Manny WB. Oh, mate, I'm done till next season. I'm just wondering. How Arteta can ruin Arsenal in the summer? Could it's it be, be Raheem... Real Madrid PSG final? Could it be the Raheem Sterling coming to Arsenal from Chelsea this summer? Who is he going to shock us with? Who is he going to shock us with, guys? Anyway, it's penalty shootouts. Shouts out to RB. He must be sitting there biting his blood clot nails right about now. I can I can sort of um, you know put my um, um, uh, I'm willing to, to to bet you a good sum that whoever wins this match will go on to win the whole tournament. There's going to be Real Madrid PSG in the final. Could be. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's still that's still what uh, Manny's saying. Whoever wins this match tonight is going to win the actual tournament. And yeah, I fully agree. This it's only I thought Man City would win the tournament, and I do believe it's only these two teams. Yep. Again, because if Man City or Real Madrid qualify, they're going to slap their fucking granny out of Bayern Munich. Don't have it wrong, boys. You bet. Maybe we were saved. Ma maybe we were saved a beating by uh, you know losing beating. tonight. I can't wait to see Bayern Munich get slapped up. But Bayern Munich against Real, that's going to be another classic. Or Bayern against City, and of course, and both um, Guardiola and Ancelotti managed at Bayern. Of course. But getting back to the Ancelotti, it's the appetite, bruvs. It's like, obviously, bruvs, he's a millionaire, isn't it? He's clearly not doing this for the dough, isn't it? He's not young anymore. Um, he loves football. Bruvs, just going to fucking shitty Everton showed you. It was like, uh, look at my eyebrow. My eyebrow is standing towards the north. It means North London. Eh, hey, I'm only in England to go off fucking gain at the Arsenal fucking job, eh? Hey, why do you think I come to fucking Everton? I don't even know what Everton is, eh? Hey, fucking Liverpool next door. Fucking hell, I didn't even know. Hey, I know about Liverpool. Hey, I'm only in fucking here in England because I want a job at the like at the Arsenal. That that's just the way Mourinho hated fucking Arsenal. She was like, you know what? You know and that's the thing. I did not want to come to Arsenal because I did not want to work with the Cronkies. You see? No, bruv, he, was, uh, bruv, he went to fucking Everton and worked with fucking fucking. Mashiri. That's the one who wanted to buy Arsenal. So what I'm saying is, he had to work with fucking. John Barnes, bros, it doesn't fucking matter who was. I should have said Paul Merson. Bros, listen, he would have, he would have loved a job at Ars like Arsenal at that sort of time. Right. So but no, no, no. Says... Arsenal didn't have the foresight, but Real Madrid come and took him away. Yep. And it should have been Arteta going. Oh, oh no, look, it's almost like Jean Arby reads my fucking mind. Yeah, bro. If he had joined us, I say, I say, just to piss me off, Man City win. I just, I just said a big shout out to you on the stream. Shouts out dedication, a humble clock, them RB. Because you know what? Listen, and watch, hold on. Do you know what you lot are going to do to Bayern Munich? Yeah, five nil home leg. Yeah, and then you're going to go to Germany and win three one. Yeah, eight one, the blood clot over two legs. Don't fuck a Haaland. Don't need Haaland. That's a statement by Pep. That's a right. state. I'm going to be just put your loudspeaker. Guys, carry on. That's rude. Okay. Just answer the phone. 
Right, I can tell you now the first penalty taker is Julian Alvarez. Edison will it's be not... the hero just because you said it, bros. It'll be out. We'll see right now. We'll see right now. Manny, tell me. Uh, Who's taking okay, the first kick? So, Julian Alvarez, one of the... Alvarez uh, steps up. World Cup. Alvarez against I'm a Lunin. bad man. Not too sure Lunin is one of the uh, best keepers with regard to saving penalties. Edison might have saved a few. I don't necessarily know how good he is in shootouts. Jude Bellingham. That was, they got everyone, don't worry. I don't know. Okay, Alvarez against Lunin. Right for the Alvarez against the Ukrainian up. keeper. Goal sent goal. Me the wrong way. City City one nil. Alvarez scores. Goal 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 goal. I mean, it was a pretty weak dive. Jump by onto Luna the channel, you motherfucker. Side. We're ahead of you, so you may as well come here. Mine, yeah. my channel, you motherfucker. Okay, so oh, who's going to take Madrid's first penalty? Leagues. Yeah. Exactly. Same Captain Fantastic himself, Luca Modric. It's Luca Although Modric. Luca Modric steps up. Yeah, but um, it's actually Nacho who's wearing the captain's armband, but Modric is pretty much the uh, heartbeat of the team right now. He Brush, came on as a throw sub. your TV down because it could be the first yeah, one to take the penalty. Modric against Edison. Saved. I oh, saved. Edison fucking saves it. Oh my fucking word. I'm not lying, bros. I'm live on my team. Fucking Modric has missed, bros. I told you you're going for it and you're going to murk by Munich. Fuck you. Not the best of penalties. Edison guessed the right way. A weak penalty, really, from the number 10. And uh, easy stuff. Your two penalties ahead of us. Who is it, Maddie? Looks like Bernardo Silva. You're ahead of me, man. Hey, it's Bernardo Silva stepping up. Yeah, he's not missing. He's not missing. No fucking way. I'm on Modric. I'm only on Modric. Why can't I hear anyone? There's no one talking. Manny. I'm silent. Oh, why? Silver against Lunin. Will there be a silver lining? And he shoots it straight at Lunin. Oh, oh silver misses. Silver fucking misses. Fuck what about you... Silver misses. Real Madrid for making a 1 1. Eh, the ball is going to be grand in my card, so. Oh, boy, oh, boy. That was an even worse if. penalty than the Modric one. I said if they score now. Was he trying to go for a Penenka? I don't know. But whatever happens, um, it's Bellingham who's got this kick, and he has to it's score. It's Bellingham steps up. Bellingham ain't going to miss shit. It, hey, Jude. No, no, he's been under pressure for quite some time. I'd Jude, be surprised Jude, if he scores. Jude, Jude, Jude. Tired. Scores, sends Edison the wrong way. Edison scores! Jude! 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 Birmingham boy scoring in Manchester. Lovely. Saw Edison going one way, calmly placed it to the other side. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Mateo Kovacic. It's Kovacic stepping up. I think he misses. He scores, he scores. No, he could Kovacic. miss. He scores. Kovacic against Lunin. Saved by Lunin. It's saved by a Lunin. I told you Kovacic penalty. will miss. Saved. A dreadful penalty went to I'm completely not changing. Shut up. Low, low and on the center. Too close to the Kovacic goalkeeper. Kovacic misses. Man City are now been gifted. Gifted the chance to whoop by Munich. Who steps up next? He did miss. He did. Lunin. I mean, Real Madrid, sorry. Lucas no. Vasquez, who came it's on. Vasquez stepping up to give Real Madrid the advantage. Lucas Vasquez. Lucas Vasquez against Edison Moraes. The drama is almost intolerable. You can cut the tension with a knife. Sends him the wrong way. Oh, Real Vasquez Madrid. scores! Vasquez! Manny, what's the score? 
I believe it's 2 1 to Madrid. Yes. So City cannot afford to miss this next penalty. Otherwise, two Madrid ones around Madrid. Is it two penalties team. left? Or one? I believe there are two left. It's 2 1 to Madrid. Two penalties left each. Mad um, City have missed two. Silva and Kovacic. After Modric missed, it was uh, Bellingham and up? now Vasquez. Foden with his it's left Phil foot. It's Phil Foden. I back Phil. 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 I back Phil Foden to score. Well, and you backed him correctly. He scored. And Set Phil Foden has scored. Way. It's 2-2. Two, two. Phil Foden. But this fourth penalty is the, mo is the most important penalty of the shootout. This if is Real the most Madrid important. Score, yeah. If, if Real, Real Madrid score, score, it's a big score. fuck you to a fucking Man City. Yeah. Who's stepping up? The captain, Nacho. It's Nacho stepping up. Eh, hey, Nacho. And it's not Nacho Monreal, it's another guy. Cheesy Nachos. And he scores. He scores. He sent... Oh, I froze. He's... I froze. Blood clot, I froze. Boys, I'm a froze. Brilliant penalty from the skipper. Sending Edison the wrong way. Powerful penalty, low and true. And so who's taking it? Of all the people to take a penalty is Edison Moraes, the goalkeeper. He's setting himself up for ridicule. If he misses, City are out. They're out. Well, he doesn't miss. But Real's next penalty will win it. So no matter what, they, they would have won. Well, you've got to give credit to Edison. Uh, certainly a proper penalty. Lunin dived the right way, but it was well placed, hit with the right amount of power. If Edison saves this, I mean, literally, he'll go down in folklore. But it's Antonio Rudiger, the Chelsea central defender, the former Chelsea central defender. He's been a colossus in the defense. I don't know if he's a striker. Why he's opting to take a penalty, I don't know. But we will see. Rudiger against Edison. Rudolf scores. No, wait, we'll see. He scores! City are out. No treble for Guardiola. Real Madrid are through. And that's another English team knocked out of Europe. Boys, what's going on? What happened, Manny? Real Madrid won. Yeah. Uh, Rudiger scored. Oh, Real Madrid win. Real Madrid, Real Madrid. Real Madrid. I'm going to whoop. I'm Munich's ass. And, hey. and, to, and, and, and to Pep Guardiola and Manchester City, all I will say is this. Na, 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 na. Na, 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 na. na, na. Guardiola. Hey, hey, hey. Bahako. Goodbye. Man City got done. Na, na, Man City na. got done. Na, 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 na. Hey, hey, hey. You're Shout out to out. Manu. Manu. <laughs> uh, well, I don't know if I'm happy or sad. Like, Man City got fucked off as well, but it means nothing because. Remember, bro. Remember, bro. You brought Edison because he plays out from the back. What do you want from him? You want him to save penalties? You want him to play out from the back? I mean, you got to, you got to, you got to trust your boy Guardiola, the man. Bye, bye, Peppy. <laughs> Who's on the phone? My friend, Man City fan, RB. He's pissed, and I'm loving it, to be honest with you. <laughs> like, what a penalty. In off the post. How much pressure would he have been under? Guessed correctly, Edison, but uh, placed perfectly. Had that been a little bit to right, the left, that would have been a miss, but... Um, Antonio Rudiger, you all of the Arsenal it. fans that have been real. Hey right, guys, I'll aim at the super fans today because what did I say? Arteta is a bottle job. I would literally rather Brendan Rodgers in charge of Arsenal. Do you know what I mean? Right, I'm going to change between both of them. All right, one minute. WB, I think these boys are exiting, so let me call you back. Yeah, I'm going to get out the stream. All right, ciao. Love, right, love, love, love. Oh, oh, WB's gone. WB, you disappeared. Then WB. WB's in the stream. Um, uh, uh, RB, I'll call you back. One sec. That was an ignorant hang-up. 
Oh, Manny, Manny, Manny. What's your final thoughts, bro? It's me and Manny. Do what we do. Let's talk oh, our final thoughts. What's what, your final thoughts, What can thought, I Manny? say? You, you know what? Uh, I am so glad that after watching that limp uh, impotence display by Arsenal, we got to see two gladiator teams duke it out. It went all the way to penalties. Real Madrid defended manfully. They got their penalties spot on. City choked. No domestic treble this time around. No and to be honest, you brothers, let's have it right. If Arsenal had played either of them two Galacticos, as you just called them, guess what would have happened? It would have been a big... F what is that there? Okay, I never ripped off the tag. All right. Yeah, I just see something shining at me. Um, Arsenal would have been smashed by either of these two teams that performed tonight. Let's have it absolutely right. Absolutely. You're right. You're well behind. Madrid won. I'd rather Harry Redden up in charge. I'd rather Paul Merson in charge of Arsenal than fucking Arteta. Yeah, I mean, Merson's teetotal now, so at least he's not going <laughs> to tolerate a drinking culture. There you go. There you go. But, um, guys, I don't know if I'm going to do a reaction because how the fuck do I react to that? So, shouts out to Manny. Real one. Shouts out to WB. Um, it's been emotional. We're at the Champions League, people. Uh, Manny, is that you till next season? Shall we cover a league game uh, between now and the end of the season? Or is that you? I, I would actually prefer that we do a season review. We do a season review. And regarding tomorrow, let me know, because I'll just jump onto wherever you are, all right? Because um, I'm going to get the fuck out of here, bros. I don't know. Like, like your mum said, uh, mom, 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 blah, 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 blah. your mum may have told you when you was a nipper or a kid. Um if you've got nothing nice to say, don't say nothing because I just don't even know at this moment how to... Like, this is not a brilliant Bayern Munich team. This is not someone that we should have been in awe of. This is not... It weren't Man City or Real Madrid is basically what I'm trying to say in a fucking nutshell. And we've choked again. DJ DQ, shouts out to you, bros. Long time no see. And yeah, we got fucking murked, bros. What can you say in it? We got murked. I love that confused. terminology. We got murked. By a, very, that? Very, by a very, very, very normal Bayern Munich team. And murked is a bit of a street terminology. You got murked, lad. Your team got murked. I've heard, I've, I've heard that. If you've seen Rio Ferdinand's World Cup wind-ups, you'll hear the term. Ah, because he, he goes on a little bit. I've seen him on interviews recently. He talks a lot of road and a lot of what happened growing up. And safe man and yeah he does a bit of yeah he, he grew up in he grew up in peckham famous of course as being the place where only fools and horses was uh and believe me shot. it's it's definitely not like growing up in a place like hackney so do you know what i mean but hold on i aim at lewis hamilton all the time because i grew up on the streets in the ghetto bros he grew up in a nice little rich area called cambridge fuck off the fucking ghetto you can't what can you say yeah, Arsenal Twitter's going mad at the moment. But anyway, listen, I am going to um, hop on to Northside's channel. I think he might have a call-in show. But uh, Danny, brother, it has been a pleasure. We As shall always. meet at the uh, we shall meet at the end of the season. But until then, do stay in touch with me on WhatsApp or Twitter. As I said, if there's anything you. going on tomorrow, let me know. And yeah, the season review in it. We'll, we'll do. literally, we'll, we'll do. literally, we'll literally, we won't even wait a moment. As soon as the day is done, bang, end of the season, bang, we'll give it to the people. We'll do. Definitely, Manny, absolutely. Yeah. You're a fucking legend. Peace out, Manny. Guys, from me, Cheers, it everyone. is time to also disappear from the stream. Yeah, man. Um, we're rubbish. <laughs> no, we're not rubbish, but yeah. It's disappointing. And I didn't expect nothing yeah. less from Arsenal Football Club tonight. So yeah. I just don't even know what to say. Uh, I love you, DJ DQ. You're a real one. Big up, Ange Pesta. Because I think he's done wonders. Give him one or two windows, bruvs, because... At best, Madison is probably his signing because everyone else, the keeper, the left back in Doogie, whatever you want to call him, they were already signed. Mubs. They were already done under the previous regime. So, and he lost Kane. So, give him a minute, man. Ange would have managed fucking Arsenal better than what fucking Arteta has done right now. Would I take Ange Pestacoglu in fucking ahead of Arteta? All day long. Guys, on that note, peace out and God bless. I'm going to disappear from the stream. Shouts out to WB. Manny, shouts out to everyone that has joined tonight. Uh, nine of us here. No one's really talking. Maybe they're all fucking speechless. Like, or maybe it's just because I'm always right. I was like, nah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. We're not going to win the Champions League. We're not winning no league. Uh, whether we're continues. nine points clear, whether we're nine points clear, or just going neck to neck with uh, Liverpool and Man City, we're gonna fuck up one way or another. 
Arteta's Arsenal is going to fuck you. But on that note, guys, peace out. God bless. Uh, I doubt 10.55. Should I do a quick reaction? I don't know. Let me walk the dog. Shouts out to Loco. Shouts out to me and Manny. I'll walk the dog and decide the anger levels, how they're doing. Let me roll myself a big joint. And um, yeah, peace out, people. Please like, please subscribe. Shouts out to me and Manny, WB. Um, and yeah, let's see how Arteta fucks up the summer transfer window. Good night, people. God bless.